Hello, and welcome to Legacy of Fools. <laughs> One sec, hold on, Tim. <laughs> what? Please, yeah, the, your, the, camera. your camera? <laughs> Immediately no. Immediately no. <laughs> Immediately. You know what? Let's start over. No, I'm just kidding. It's it's your mic. It's uh, all fucked, I think is the technical term. Oh, no. What happened? Every it's it's oh, your yeah. beautiful you baby. You Thank keep you. doing you. I'm going to hold the intro till things are done happening around me. Take I hope this is entertaining two. to watch. All right. We're it's going, confusing to be in. Hold on. We're going back to the logo. Okay. He can keep do this. Yeah, Go bam, for it bam. now. <laughs> Seamless. Hello. How are you all doing? I you, someone yelled vamp at me, and I don't know what to say. Just intro the show now. Be a oh. vampire. Oh. Hmm. Uh, Lovely. Thank you, children of the night. <laughs> um, Here's Strad. Welcome to Legacy of Fools, a seamlessly produced uh, actual play D and D stream <laughs> where <laughs> one adventurer's choices can affect the lives of many adventurers to come. Broadcasting to you live from an isolated room floating somewhere in the ethereal plane. Uh, and just a note, you're watching a very special episode of Legacy of Fools tonight. This is Legacy of Fools Classy as Fuck Edition. Fuck yeah. The only difference for which is that uh, you guys aren't going to be able to see it, but there is a large charcuterie board in a corner of the room Fuck that yeah. no one can actually get to during the game. Some people have grabbed their own place. So when the game is like... 20 minutes long. <laughs> You'll know why. We just wanted to get back to that sweet, sweet charcuterie board. That oh, sweet, wow. sweet charcuterie. Wow, yeah. I got to us and everybody's gone. <laughs> <laughs> They're eating charcuterie. Where did, where did you go? Tim's, Tim's camera was bothering me. I had to go fix it. Okay, now Tim's camera's great. I don't know where my phone is. Oh, I do now. <laughs> get some charcuterie <laughs> while you're over there, Jen. We're going to have yeah. the players intro themselves and hopefully Jen will be, we'll be back sure. by the time we get to her. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Jamie. I'm playing Jaden. Palacious Cross Garden. <laughs> Hi, I'm Amanda, and I play Ollie. Palacious Cross Garden. <laughs> <laughs> are we married? Here yeah, we are now. <laughs> you don't take their middle name. No, with Palacious you do. <laughs> Hi, I'm Eric, and I'm playing Rothgar. I'm Amy, and I'm playing Roz, and I forgot to get Sharkary before we started. <laughs> well, have some Whoa! of my <laughs> Fly in the charcuterie, guys. <laughs> um, I'm Genevieve. I am turning on my iPad, and I'm playing Bronwyn. That's the one. <laughs> wow. Shush. It's always a fun Seamless. time to see if Jen remembers her character. <laughs> it is literally a every roller coaster week. ride every week. We're off to such a strong start. Fuck this is yeah. gonna be a good one, Weird. guys. Uh, anybody have anything they want to talk about? Any announcements to start the night? <sighs> yeah. First, I want to say hold on to your butts. Second of all, I want to say uh, what is art still premiering next Tuesday on Amazon Prime? Check it out, everybody. <laughs> Sketch comedy, an hour special. I'm in it. Yeah, you are. So it's great. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like that to start that announcement, Jamie turned into Samuel L. Jackson in <laughs> Jurassic Park. <laughs> it happens Will whenever. he suffer the same fate by the end of the stream? Oh, we hope not. Not Jaden, Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is what I meant. And I forget how he goes, so I'm really scared. Oh, no. Somehow it makes it much worse. later, just in case there's not watching the stream, who has uh, watched the like, Yeah, but movie. it was a bit, so oh, okay. maybe let the sleepy dogs lie. And Jen of in the comments has actually nailed a whole bunch of stuff that's in Ashok Kuduri. There is hard salami. There is Gouda. Wow. There is a cheddar. I don't know that it's an Irish cheddar. And there are olives. So... Amazing. If you want a charcuterie board, yeah, that's what you should add to it. A anyway. lesson I learned eating that charcuterie board earlier, by the way, is don't pop a piece of dark chocolate in your mouth and then pop an olive in there before you're <laughs> done chewing the chocolate. Yeah. Also, anyway. just don't pop olives in there. Olives are wrong. Oh. Please continue your announcements. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm gonna. Um, I don't normally, but I'm gonna agree with Jamie on this one. Don't that's pop your announcement. Olives, in there. <laughs> olives yeah. are great. Fuck yeah. Boop. So what are we here for? So, I, I, I mean, it's a bit, but it's a bit of a PSA. I'm getting my license renewed tomorrow, so hey, oh. maybe check your driver's license. <laughs> and Especially if you're having a birthday. I feel like yeah. that's always true, the actually. Case. Oh, always. I should check it. Yeah, um, so just a little PSA. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, if, if it helps one person. It helps one, on that same vein, a good friend of mine is trying to get a new passport and is having terrible trouble. Oh. And I was talking to her earlier, and a guy at the passport office on the phone told her uh, that they have an appointment next week in Colorado. Helpful. <laughs> she gonna go? No. <laughs> so, Real helpful. Um, if you Sounds need like a new passport, passport. go on that far in advance. Or go to Colorado. In process. Uh, anyway. Alrighty. So, 
If we play D and D here, we're gonna do that. Oh yeah, <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. That's right. Um, trying. When last we played, uh, the party. Uh, Can we get some music? Yeah. Thank you. The party brought their uh, newly taken prisoners back from the Red Brand hideout under Tresendar Manor to the Townmaster's Hall of Phandalin to have them locked up, uh, piling a good eight prisoners into two cells in the basement of the uh, the Townmaster's Hall, two small holding cells. And after a bit of conversation upstairs, the party decided to go down and question the bugbear they had captured about the location of Cragmaw Castle, only to find that uh, the rest of the prisoners in there, the Red Brands, uh, put in close proximity with their boss, the Glass Staff, had uh, murdered the two goblinoids placed in there with them, leaving there no one in town who knows the location of Cragmaw Castle. Uh. Um, the party has decided to explore other avenues in the area, take on other tasks, and hope they can, as they travel around, find other leads to get them to Gunner Rockseeker, but in the meantime, have accepted a job from Halia Thornton, uh, who, unbeknownst <laughs> to most of the party, offered Bronwyn a position in a shady criminal-slash-spy organization called the Centaurum. Uh, what the party does know is that she has hired Bronwyn to steal a uh, magic lantern that, as she describes it, can find ore through the ground, uh, and bring it for, uh, from the uh, vault in the country home of a wealthy halfling woman by the name of Lorna Oakridge, who lives 20 miles or so from Phandalin in a secluded location in the countryside. Uh, with the logic that that lantern could very much help the people of Phandalin, she's not using it for anything, and the party has reluctantly agreed. They headed off on that journey, um, traveling peacefully for most of the day, but then taking a rest in the countryside, realized that there were a trio of orcs bearing down upon them. And it is in that moment that we left you, so it is to that moment that we return. You are sitting, having an afternoon rest and snack, and Char you see these orcs on their way. Are we having a charcuterie board? Yes. Uh, that is the rations you were all carrying. <laughs> charcuterie. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. I mean, though, honestly, <laughs> it is usually like dried ham and cheese. Yeah. 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 So honestly, yeah. not too far off. It's yeah. not that far off. Yeah. Remember, if you're ever Cut up an at apple. a fancy party eating charcuterie, it's just rations. <laughs> <laughs> rations. You should uh, refer to them as such as well. I believe Bronwyn is the one who mix. spotted them. Did I? I think. Did now. Okay. Um. Wait. Afternoon snack? But no, we're on the road now. You are on the road now. You've been on the road the bulk of the day. It's getting towards evening, but it's not quite there yet. Um, is there any way I can hide? Have they spotted us? They do, you guys are kind of out in the open. They do seem to see you and be headed in your direction. And we do keep going. <laughs> Charcuterie! <laughs> Delicious! <laughs> We're just practicing being fancy people say? before we no, go to this fancy is. people party. <laughs> Precisely. Um, whoa! Uh, anyone know anything about those guys? Who now? Do you point can out we, the do, Can we see them? No, I'm gonna yeah, point you can out all see them. them. Oh. Do uh, they? It's like an open field. Oh. They're visible. They are coming Shit. toward us. What? Sword drop. Do they <laughs> seem upset or angry or intensely give approaching me a, us? Give me an insight check. Great. Blow my dice, please. Thank you. Uh, 15. Not necessarily angry. Aggressively? That they, the look in their eyes isn't reassuring, but it's not like anger. Mm -hmm. It's, imp whatever it is, it's imp sort of impassive. Do we want to just try to stay out of their way? I don't feel like I, we need to engage if they try to engage with us. They're, I mean, they're, they're heading toward They're us. coming toward us, so I don't know if we're going to. Yeah, well, let's let's scooch over. <laughs> How far do we have to scooch before? Yeah, could we could we make a scooch check? Could we just get on out of the Scooter. way? Is it feasible that we could just yeah. kind of get out of their way? Yeah. At least attempt to and see if they don't want anything to do with us. I mean, in theory, yeah. Okay, yeah, let's, let's just get out of like, the way. Just step out of the way. These guys seem like they mean business. I sure. don't want to. They got places to be in people. You guys to see. get up and start scooching and over, people, and a voice calls out to you. It says, "You're not getting out. You're not moving on our account, are you?" Oh, no, just 
Wanted to make sure you could get through. You look like you're headed somewhere important. Didn't want to get in your way. Oh, well. Just out to uh, foraging, looking for uh, goods and supplies on our way back to the rest of our people. Let's do a yeah. insight check yeah. on that. Because yeah. yeah. me, the player, is pretty sure he's not foraging. Oh, I rolled a natural 20. Yeah, yeah. good. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, then, I, I have an unnatural 20. I rolled a... What am I rolling? Inside. 10. 16. <laughs> and you got what? Unnatural 20. Unnatural 20, that's what I thought you said. Okay. Um, I feel like anybody who got over like a 12 or so. Mm -hmm. Nope. He's being a little disingenuous. He's not trying to hide it particularly. Mm -hmm. He's uh, sort of saying this with a smirk. And really... You don't necessarily detect that a foraging is a lie, it's just all a matter of what one considers foraging. I see. Yeah, yeah Jaden uh, doesn't have his sword raised, but has his sword drawn and down at his side. Yeah, I've got a just hand on a, on a ready. hand axe myself. Mm -hmm. I also have my hand on my arrow. And the one who's doing the talking, they're like a good 50 feet off at this point. Mm -hmm. One who's, and have stopped. The one who's doing the talking sort of calls out, you should be careful just Sitting out in the open, in the countryside like this, there could be dangerous people around. And you ought to be careful coming up on a group of stanger. Stangers? <clears throat> shut, oh. shut up, shut up, shut the fuck up, shut up, <laughs> shut up, Ollie. <laughs> Would anyone else like to take the lead on this one? <laughs> strangers! <laughs> because you don't know if that group of strangers is dangerous themselves. <laughs> and the other two join in laughing. They're like, <laughs> Well, I don't appreciate being laughed at, and I'm gonna launch a hand. Oh, 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 shit! Oh, Roll initiative. <laughs> well, we, that escalated quickly. I'm sorry, you laughed at I me. Had cast oh, escalators. Um, well, thank you. I don't feel like fighting. <laughs> <laughs> well, no. you don't have to fight just because you're in initiative. You, you can sit down and, <laughs> and read a knock knock book. <laughs> a knock knock book, huh? Yeah. No you know, punchlines. Please elaborate. Just setups. It's just knock knocks. Knock knock. I'll it's never know who's at this fucking door. <laughs> over and over again. In pairs. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Different fonts. Ooh. <laughs> this page is Comic Sans. <laughs> <laughs> Jen, do you want to put my empty plate under your full plate? Thanks. Chat, we would have said uh, stranger, stranger danger, danger, but there was literally no time before Hrothgar decided to <laughs> throw fucking an <laughs> throw an axe and turn them into living. You know, I, that's actually charcuterie. what I was going to say until I fucked up the sentence. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, really? I swear, I swear. No, I believe I, it. I, I believe I, it. I, I, Is that right. why you said dangerous? Because you were trying to say st stranger <laughs> danger? <laughs> He's had a, he's had a couple of roadies with him. He's of course he has. That's also why he's. Uh, anyone above twenty. <laughs> in life, yes, but in the initiative, no, definitely no. not. All right, fifteen to twenty. Oh no! Oh no! Ten to fifteen. Oh thank God! What do you God. got? Twelve. Oh no! That's our highest. We're uh oh gonna Sad die. Face. We're Five gonna die. Five to ten. <laughs> oh wait, actually yes. Oh, oh, yeah, fuck. Seven. Oh. I just zoned out for a while. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. Oh, it's gonna be five to, or one to five? What are you at? Five, because I have plus four, but I rolled a natural one. Ooh. Get it out of your system. Yep, get him out mm -hmm. now. Uh what do you got? Uh I got a four. I also got a four though. I, your dex is higher than mine, right? You have yeah. a Oh yeah. But not by much. What were you? Speedy Seven. wizard. 12744. Four. Oh, what was it? Yeah, 1274. 12, 54. Oh, we're gonna die now. We're having charcuterie. There's probably some wine. We're having a nice day. He had too much to drink. He, he's getting into a bar fight. Well, Gar, you're up first, which is appropriate. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So you want to hand axe? Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. What, what am I, go ahead. Oh, what, no. let me know. What, is the, uh, what is the range on the hand axe? Uh, 20 feet or up to 60 feet with disadvantage. So that, they are 50 feet away. It is going to be disadvantage. All right. <laughs> you run your little tiny uh, up. Actually, before oh, we get too run. into it, uh, I'll, oh, I accidentally closed the map I was trying to put you guys onto in the little funny. 
He's got like big Aladdin energy, right? Yeah, yeah. that's exactly say, what I was thinking. I was gonna say Star Wars kind of a vibe. Oh, oh very yeah. much yeah. that too. Right. I just had you arbitrarily in a line preset on this map. How do you guys want to be set up? You know, when like, you get in a line and he'd shark you. I think you're more in like a clump. <laughs> That's We're not gonna play Red I Rover just, with I, I, their did, I did this just to put you on the map, yeah. assuming you guys would tell me. Uh, how I think we would have been in a half circle or a line of three and a line of two. Yeah, I think I'd be in the front. <laughs> Jamie, chew okay. your food. Away. Oh my. <laughs> so we're, okay, I'm gonna, all right, sassy pantsus. I'm gonna um, put Rothgar right in the front there. Everyone else can tell me where to put them in relation to Rothgar. Nice. Uh, honestly, I don't hate that. Uh, yeah, <laughs> just leave, uh, leave I don't off. like where I am. I feel very out of the conversation. Jaden's close uh, to the frontish. Yeah, you're, you're right here, right next to Arthur. Right. You want to be like? I know, but like, I feel like Do we'd be to, sitting in a circle. circle. I was there. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Jaden, Ross didn't want to talk to Arthur. Jaden is on the same vertical plane just, as Rothgar, yeah, but I, more I south. You want to be in yeah. the circle? Uh, yeah, probably two, uh, three spaces. Oh no, south. Wait, yeah, 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 yeah. One more down, and then that's perfect. Well, now I'm in the middle. Thank you. <laughs> Are we Everyone's happy with this arrangement? I look like everybody's talking at me. <laughs> <laughs> this is for the well, fighting we part. We can assume you got up and rearranged when you were interacting Everybody, with Everybody, battle formation. We specifically <laughs> talked about you getting up. That's not where I'd sit if I was eating charcuterie, but <laughs> fine, You're Tim. Not you were where going, you're sitting while eating. She was going over to the board to grab a few more things, mm. and it the was charcuterie wanted it all in. Mm -hmm. All right, stream canceled. Uh, <laughs> Tim, you're doing amazing. Yeah. Everybody else is insufferable. <laughs> all right, Rothgar. All right. Uh, go ahead and make that attack roll at disadvantage. Uh, is this a uh, strength or dexterity modifier? Uh, this strength. Throwing I will say, strength. if you want to do a run, 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 then throw. You Look, the min max so player you. in me wants to, Fair. but the character play is. I commend you. Yeah. Go for it. Because I'm throwing it. Uh, also, which one are you throwing it at? Uh, the middle guy, green. Uh, that would have been the one who was stalking. Yeah. That's, that's why you're gonna get two nat twenties right I'm now. I'm going to shut him up. I sure am the are. danger. Sure. Are. Stranger nice. danger. Oh no. Fuck. All right, hey, we're, we're sitting pretty good. We're sitting pretty good. We're sitting pretty good. That's gonna be a, a nine. Yeah. Nine does not hit. You just <laughs> oh, wheel overhand throw it from that yeah, distance okay. away, and it just <laughs> through the air, and then the arc begins to lower, and it just <laughs> into the grass at their feet. What do you think of us now? Whoa! Ah, ah, ah. That was a warning. That this is Bro. gonna be easier than we thought. Whoa! Well, what are we doing? Why do we need to engage? They're orcs. So? Yes, my thoughts exactly. That doesn't mean they're inherently bad. It doesn't? <laughs> have you met a good orc? I haven't. We could have just offered him some have. olives and called it a day. Do you want any olives and we'll call it a day? You can literally have all of them. <laughs> all of them. <laughs> <laughs> put all your stuff on the ground and walk away and we won't kill you. All oh, of our uh, olives? <laughs> all of your everything. Olives won't be so good once they've been on the ground. See, now we were being reasonable, and now they're being unreasonable. Rock, How? Anything else? <laughs> no, that'll end it. I'm just chatting. All right, Ross. Just chatting, shooting the shit. Oh, boy. I, <laughs> I don't want to fight. Yeah. It's, it's a free action to grab an olive. <laughs> <laughs> it's right here if you it's want it. I'm going to grab an olive and say, you're lost. <laughs> uh, yeah. And then, ugh, ugh fine. <laughs> Dumbass. I'm gonna throw my spear, but non-lethally. I'm not gonna kill him in this, but I'm gonna like not try to hurt him more than a little. Uh, all right. Uh, the range on that spear. That spear. Uh, that's a twenty slash something. What is I feel this? like it's a twenty sixty. Is yes. Yeah. Throw twenty sixty. Yeah. So this will be at disadvantage. Okay. Unless you run up. Unless close, you run so. forward. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a matter of principle. This whole battle must be from afar. <laughs> I'm not gonna fucking die fighting your battles. No one's gonna die while I'm around. <laughs> All right, go ahead and roll it. Fair. <laughs> it's true. I hope. Oh. Well. well. <laughs> Just wait. <where? laughs> I'm sorry for saying oh. That's a one. That's oh, a that one. Hit. Yeah. That gets like halfway and just in the ground. Raj just goes, we have, whatever. <laughs> we have two fighters who are just like, nope, we're not gonna do that. And then our cleric's like, fuck off. All right, anything else for your turn, Raj? That was another warning. Yeah. Can I have another olive? Yes. I want another yes. olive. Yes, Roman. Mm. 
Me next? Oh yeah. How did they roll really poorly uh -huh. as well? D well, thank fuck. They suck. Um, they actually tied with you, but you have higher decks. Fuck. Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, that this sounds great. This this warning will be a little more painful. I hope. I can hardly hope. And then I'm gonna go for my. Um, I still haven't really written it down, but my um, crossbow? light crossbow. <laughs> Um, you said that, I still haven't found the thing for that, but you said that's the same in my short bow, but it's, uh, a 1d8 instead of 1d6. Mm-hmm. But it's, is it also sure. gonna be 80, 320? Mm-hmm. Uh, it is. For light crossbow? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, 80, 320 means this won't be a disadvantage for me, right? Mm -hmm. Uh, that will not be a disadvantage, no. Sick, within normal range. Well, let's see if it even means anything. Um, Please be sick and not nasty. 17. Uh, 17. For the green guy. Yeah, it's. Okay. Yeah, see? More painful, like I said. <laughs> um, and I'm gonna do... Uh, D8. Um, ooh. Uh, 11 damage. Ooh. 11 damage. Very nice. Yeah, you just pull out the crossbow and <laughs> let it out, and it just, like, right under his rib cage. Yeah. Uh, he's looking... He actually, there's, like, blood pumping out of that wound now. Mm -hmm. He's looking rough. Can you see that we're serious now? Uh. And I'm done with my turn. All right, that's how it's gonna be. And then turns and mutters something in Orcish to the one next to him. Oh. We better run. You next. should consider running away. <laughs> He's gonna just pull a great axe ah! off his back and go. Rah! Oh, and that's just big. Start sprinting towards you. Right up to you, Bron, and he's gonna swing the axe. Goop. How much movement does he fucking have? Like Gwyneth Paltrow's goop? I think that's copyrighted. Yeah. <laughs> oh, orcs can do a thing. <laughs> and he sticks a jade egg. <laughs> 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 that is an 18 to hit. Oh, shit. Um, yes, that hits. <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. Uh, oh, that will be seven slashing. Okay, oh, but we all have extra from. Or the cleric earlier. Oh, yeah, the cleric. Oh. <laughs> well, because I oh. looked at him and I went, Eric the cleric. And uh. I was like, I don't know what his, his character name <laughs> Middle one is going to charge straight at Rothgar. Fair. And swing okay. his axe. Fair. That one is, that is not a good roll. That is a 10 to hit. All right. Sorry, I'm adjusting lighting. I'm not getting a watch out this time. Uh, assuming 10 doesn't hit you. No, it does not. And the third is going to charge at Roz. No. But I didn't even want to do this. <laughs> <laughs> but you did throw a spear. Not well. No, not well at all. Doesn't that count for anything? <sighs> people who threw things uh, instead of over people who didn't throw things. That's how they're going. Are you saying if we fuck around that, is, that we're going to find, find out? out? Yeah. That's a 21 damage. God damn it. Yeah. I thought that was a myth. I thought that, that was a myth. That one is going to be a... Uh, he sort of... <laughs> across your chest. That is nine slashing damage. Oh, I was just eating olives over here. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have the... Uh, yeah. Uh, all right. Probably we both need it. Oh, yeah. That is their turn. Jaden, you're up. All right. Uh, Jaden's going to go, Not fucking Roz! Uh, and then, oh, can I see that? Oh, you, yep, yeah, you are smart. I was being helpful. You were. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to immediately go uh, run to the one, one square to the north, uh, and attempt to shank, flanking with my shank. Uh, I'm going to do a flank shank, shank maneuver. Shank your flank. Uh, <laughs> shank. Flank shank, thank you, mank. Uh, I'm going to attack this orc. <laughs> I'm glad people laughed at that, because I, in my head I was like, mank? Stop! <laughs> Abort! <laughs> yeah. in Joseph L. Mankiewicz? Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. Uh, I assume they say that at some point in the movie. I haven't absolutely. seen it. <laughs> Almost every scene. I, I also haven't seen it, so I can't deny it. It's the last line. <laughs> Flank shank, thank you, Mank. Uh, so, um, flanking advantage. Uh, yes. Question mark? Cool. Excellent. Somehow better. Uh, and by that I mean worse. Um, that's going to be... Uh, that's going to be a 12. Uh, 12 does not hit. All right. I cry. Uh, yeah, your sword gets, like, hits torso, but he's got, they've got, like, hides on, and it sort of yeah. gets caught in the hide and doesn't quite pierce through. Yeah! 
Okay, I'm gonna pull it out. I'm gonna action surge. I'm gonna go for it again. Okay. Hell yeah. It's already a crit 19 because I'm a champion fighter, but I just wanted to see if I got a crit 20. You know. Yeah. So I'm roll that. Excellent. This is the one. Oh, it was the one. Uh, that's six points of slashing damage. With two dice. Oh, da oh no. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, I god forgot how uh, it's a crit. I man. forgot how to crit. Uh, it's uh, only two better. Uh, that is eight slashing damage. Okay. That is it. We just realized Absolutely. that I have lucky, so I should have rerolled oh. that one. Oh, no! That hurts! It's all that. It's all that. It's all that. It's all that. sodium's so uh, high right now. <laughs> okay, and that was, ha sorry, eight damage? Eight slashing damage. Yeah, so you, you, the first one gets caught, you, you draw back and go again lower, get him right in the stomach. Uh, that one is now uh, bleeding heavily as Excellent. well. Excellent. And I imagine, because I'm using Talon now, I went out and I tried to use it like a rapier, and it was a little too heavy, and it like got stuck, and I was like, oh! And then I just went and just fucking like tried to hack him. Uh, and that somehow worked. Um, <laughs> we just takes a go at you guys. So a little bit tougher than farmers. Yes, we're not I'll enjoy messing around. I'll skinning you. Ugh. Gross. Um, that's my turn. All right. Ollie, you're up. Ollie is going to sigh heavily. And then uh, take five, step five feet to the north, behind, basically behind Roz. Um, and is going to uh, raise the staff into the air, acts as a lightning rod, and I will throw a thunder wave into the ground, spell sculpting Ooh. around hey. Hrothgar and Roz, and catching the three orcs, if I can get con saves yep. from all of them. I assume they're pretty good at it, but you know. Only one way to find out. AOE shit. Here we go. Um, I'm just gonna go in terms of like horizontally right to left. Buggy. Uh, all right. First one is 14. Uh, just saves. Second one is that's Cox. Second one is uh, 13. That still meets it, beats it. <laughs> uh, and the third one is 21. Well, so none of them are moved. They still take half damage. Yeah, they do. Farts. Hang on, 2D. Um, they're gonna take a grand total of, I rolled seven total, so it's a grand total of three thunder damage, exciting times. Alright. Hell yeah. I hoped they would be pushed, but at last, no. Uh, the good news is, the, the, the talker, the green there, is looking, is reeling, is looking woozy. The shockwave sort of blasts out, just goes around your allies, and hits I imagine them. if you look in, on they're the ground. They're at least off balance. If you, if, if you, uh, like, See like an earthbender like moving the ground around. <laughs> That's what I kind of picture that yeah. looks like. Uh, anything else for your turn? Um, no. Hrothgar. I'm gonna cast a. Zoom in. Yes, thank you. So green's still in right in front of me, right? Green still is still in front of you. Yeah, I'm gonna take up the warhammer and take a swing at him. Curse Mac. <laughs> How you got? <laughs> the a uh, twenty-two to hit. Some, some to funny hit. little noises. <laughs> it's just dwarfish noises. noises. Mm -hmm. uh, one d eight plus two. Plus it's gonna be two. ten points Ooh, bludgeoning damage. Hell yeah. To green? Yes. Hell yeah. So yeah, you pull it out, just wheel back and bang across the head, and he just snaps his head to the side hard, re like reels in place for half a second and drops. Can Green. we stop now? Green's gone. Right on. I end my turn. Can, can we stop now? Yeah, now that you're, uh... Oh, yeah, I'll point the warhammer at the other two and... and do you yield? Uh... Give me a quick intimidation check. Yeah, baby. Oh, shoot, but that is... What are my stats on that? I think I'll take a little... I'll take a little negative on that one, but that's okay. Take the name. That's gonna be a two to intimidate. <laughs> one per. The, the heavily bloodied, the one that is the one that is currently heavily bloodied but still alive, just <laughs> spits a big bloody loogie to the ground Ew. and looks up at you and goes. I respect that. <laughs> looks up at you and goes. I'm gonna tear you apart if I can, and if I won't, at least I die with dignity. Hmm. I end my turn. All right. Respectable. Ross. <laughs> Ross just goes, well, 
Okay, we'll see about that. And pulls out her battle axe. <laughs> See what you make me do? <laughs> Rose, did you hear earlier they said they've been facing farmers? Uh, 15 plus... Battle axe. Mm -hmm. Strength and proficiency. Oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna redo this sheet with you one day soon. So plus four? Mm -hmm. uh, 19. 19 hits? Hell yeah. Fucking hope so. And that's two-handed. And my d10 is this guy. Yeah, we didn't fight for like three episodes. <laughs> In my defense. You're doing mm -hmm. good, you're doing good. Mm -hmm. mm, don't lie. Ooh, oh, that's oh. a 10. Uh, Plus <laughs> two yes. for some reason? Strength. 12. 12 damage? Yeah. And that, wait, that was to which one again? Uh, the that one right the, in front of me. The orange there? Sure. Yeah. Um, you plant that center of the torso, and that one slumps to the ground as well. Oh, there you go. Uh, anything else for you? I just turned to Rothgar and go, You happy? <laughs> I am proud of you, little pebble. I am. <laughs> because I'm the I'm the stone. And... I okay, it. we'll we'll come back around on it. We'll <laughs> come work, back around on it. <laughs> Alright. And uh hold on. I'm gonna pull out my dagger and Hold it against the throat of the the final one remaining, okay. the blue guy, and I'm gonna say, "Do you? Here's a long shot, but do you happen to know where Cragmaw Castle is?" <laughs> he just looks back at you, the thing under his chin, and goes, "What is that?" Inside check. <laughs> <Yeah, inside. laughs> uh, thank you. Hell yeah. Uh, not 10, 10 11, <laughs> so not great. You don't detect any lies. 17? So he has no idea. Great. <laughs> he doesn't know. <laughs> um, that was a long shot. And yeah. then I'm going to say, uh, I'm going to just keep this as like an in interrogation kind of a moment in this. I'm going to say, what have you been doing in this area? Taking things from people who shouldn't even be in this area. Why shouldn't they be in this area? Because it's ours now. Are you the only of your kind, or are there more? Oh, there are more. Oh no. Well, shit. And then I'm gonna <laughs> drag my dagger, like try and get him with my Attack dagger. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm gonna shit. try and get him with <laughs> my dagger. Um, that's the stab. That's the word. And I miss <laughs> um, also because. It's a uh, nine. Puncture. Uh, nine does not. Mm. He had too much you time. You try to drag across, and he just yeah. boom, bants mm. your arm out of the way. Because you were like talking. Yeah, because I was talking for too long. I mm. gave him too much warning. Damn. <laughs> uh, all right. You were just approaching uh, him. Orc is now gonna think. swing at you. Yeah, go on. Respectable though. Respectable. Mm -hmm. Keep the uh, keep the quest going. Mm -hmm. uh, that is sixteen to hit. Mm, owie. Or. 13 slashing damage. Oh boy. Yeah, okay. Uh, and that's gonna be that orc's turn. Uh, Jaden, you're out. All right. Uh, Jaden, is, can I see the tablet? Thank you. So sorry, you have become the tablet passer. <laughs> uh, Jaden is. Can we give you a tablet? <laughs> but she can also reach all of the food any day, so, you know, it's like. That's a, a good point. Yeah. Uh, Jaden. Yeah, Jaden is gonna. There is a single rock on the board. Jaden is going to circle around to Blue, <laughs> jumping <laughs> off the rock uh, to try and take a jumping slash at Blue. Amazing. That's pretty cinematic. I love it. And he's it. gonna go caca as he does because he's got talent. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love the caca in that voice. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it doesn't sound caca. <laughs> So uh, wimpy. Well, if, it, if it's a British accent, caca, it'd be kind of right there, wouldn't it? Or how how up across British is he? Like this much. Okay. <laughs> Great. That Ooh. is twenty-two. <coughs> uh, that jumping attack. That's just what you needed. You Hell yes! It. Oh wow! <coughs> Fantastic! It, it, it's Get real it. great. Oh, that is nine points of slashing damage. Nine points. Uh, that orc is now looking quite bloody. Uh, All right. Lovely. Yeah, you put it just sort of right in the small of his back. People who take things from other people are criminals! Uh, Ollie, you're <laughs> well, up. Only if the people didn't deserve it. Oh, shit, yes. Uh, fuck. Um, 
ice chunk ray of frost throwing at the dude. Right. Please blow on my die, Amy. Oh, nice you. fingernails. Oh, and then you, like, <laughs> drop my die on the ground. Thank you. Um, that is a uh, 18. 18 will get. Ooh. I did it. <laughs> this is why I don't blow on the dice, because that's one cold damage. <laughs> wow, that's a beautiful D8, it's, though. It's very pretty. Wow. This is why I, I mean, don't... Yeah, I don't. it... <laughs> Like, but he him across is the red pins. This was like a patch of ice on his. I really love the whole like there. four damage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a little slower, but he's already. He like, is slow. Yeah, he's slowed. All right, because that's gonna matter. Uh, yeah, you tell him. Jamie, are you just decorating a water bottle? Fuck yeah, I am. Yeah. Yeah, a bunch of stickies. Okay. Is that your turn? Yeah. Okay, Rothgar. Um, Stay no. with us, Jamie. We might need you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, I'm doing stickies. Melee range counts diagonally. Yes. All right. I'm gonna swing my warhammer at him. Just get him, a little horse. little whirlwind of a warhammer. Warhammer whirlwind. It's going. No. To be, Damn it. It's gonna be uh, six to hit. A world breeze. Six does not. Hit. Yeah. You know what? I tried a whirlwind. Not my thing. We're gonna put that Wait, away. You just now. wind up spinning in place. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. That's funny. <laughs> I like that. Uh, <laughs> Guess I just step up to this one and swing my battle axe. Don't sound depressed about it. <laughs> this is stupid. I move a step, whatever that is, north. North. Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah. I'll swing my little battle axe. But I won't be happy about no, it. <laughs> Like I you get to re-roll, re-roll a one, because yes. I'm lucky! Yes! Ooh! That's so another. 17 plus 4? Heck yeah. Mm-hmm. 21. That'll hit. Yeah, baby. Heck yeah. Stuck them up, baby. Uh, six. Six. Yeah, I'm gonna put this out there. You, you, you slam your axe into this orc. You, you kill this orc. <laughs> but you kill him in the nicest way you can. <laughs> you do it quick. You do it clean. <laughs> She's just kind of rolling her eyes the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> she just wanted to have a nice day. <laughs> uh, and you take a deep breath. The orc, the orcs now gone. The uh, countryside around uh, clear as far as you can see. Ross just turns around and goes, "Now I don't even want any more olives." <laughs> <laughs> Ollie will mage hand an olive. Just are you sure? I mean. <laughs> Wow, gonna, these guys. I'm going to rifle through their pockets. Because that's the thing that I do. As, it, you know. Yeah. A little rifler. All right. Um, you don't this, have to was, do this. I I mean, weren't these, there was something about orcs in the area. Yeah, they yeah. Were, they've mm-hmm. been messing with people in the area. I really so. didn't want to mess with that storyline. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I, I guess mean, we're in the storyline. <laughs> yeah. We found um, them. Uh, uh, in their pockets, you find a total of uh, 33 silver and 20 copper. Um, <laughs> as well as, like, assorted... 33 and 20 what? Twi- uh, 20 flat copper. copper. Uh, assorted bits of, like, food and things. Uh, and one of them has, like, a little string of what look uncomfortably like human teeth. Ooh, gross. Oh, um, why do so many people like to take trophies? Ugh. Um, b- b- not b- about this, but how much money did we get from Holly Thornton? <laughs> I think I wrote it down. Great. I believe she gave I remember we got money from her, and we then... We you to write it down. I don't remember if it was ever Please, said. It was said. Sure. She gave you... Written down here somewhere. Things um, I remembered in the middle of the week. A hundred gold. Great. So twenty gold each. Yeah. Y'all can add. Okay. Wow. <laughs> I gotta do that money session. Oh, Thursday. I gotta do that money session with you. Will yeah. we figure out how much money, money I actually we have? have and split it. Great. Look. Well, anyway. In the game. And for my real character life. as well. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, she's my accountant. It's yeah. <laughs> Shouldn't be. Uh-huh. <laughs> anyway. That would go well for everybody. So, Not registered. <laughs> um, um, do we need to take a bit of time? To heal up, uh, Jaden, you see this, and I thrust the the human teeth string in front of him. Yeah. Yeah. Barbaric. That's how I feel about your fucking elf finger necklace. Right. Now I know how you feel about it, 
perfectly well because you've yeah. made it very well known. And one might say it's barbaric. Um, what they do is barbaric. Yes, it's different. Why? In what way? I wouldn't expect you to understand. Explain to me. I'm educated. It does seem like that. Um, later. We should no. really get going. I think maybe we should take an hour. Some people took some hit hits. Is that correct? I mean, there are olives left. <laughs> we could sit for a little longer. I could, yeah, I could probably rest up a little bit. And if that. another band of orcs runs up on us, is anybody going to be mad if I protect us again? And maybe we don't start it. We can wait till they come a little closer first. Ah, and wait to be robbed? It does I'm seem gonna go like, collect my hand axe. It does seem like they don't really have much ranged, uh, like, and we all have, like, I have a crossbow, you have a crossbow. I have, you have a crossbow. A you have a crossbow and a bow. Oh, you have a spear. The, right. that, the other thing when you search them, they had the weapons and armaments. They each mm. had a great axe. They were each in high armor. Ooh. They each had two javelins. Okay, so they do have these them. things, I guess. Um, Grab some javelins? Just saying. So. I don't know. Uh, I think it, I'm the only one who got injured, right? I got a little injured. Mm. I mean, if we want to keep going, we can keep going. I'm fine. I can keep going. I don't think we should make any hard and fast rules. I, I think, think if we're going to take I a agree. pause. I agree. I think if they come towards, uh, if they are heading in our direction and we call out to them, and it seems pretty clear what they're going, you know, what they're there to do, mm. I think we start as soon as possible. We say, hey, buddy. Right. And, and they, they don't call us buddy in return? That's a good line. Or if they do, but it's like... Buddy. Buddy. Yeah. yeah, totally. We're on the same page. Um, I think we could keep going for a little bit, and if we're gonna take a a little rest, it could be somewhere a little more hidden. You yeah, know, not so much sure. like a bare open plane that of a sounds... place. Yeah. A bear. <laughs> Bare naked lady of a place. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, you know, it's just they not don't a exist sh- here. What are you <laughs> talking about? There's not a you know tree or anything to you hide. You don't know behind. the troop of bards, bare naked <laughs> ladies. <laughs> Canada doesn't <laughs> exist here. <laughs> you probably heard them referred to as BNL. Yeah, um, spam. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, fun story. This uh, world does also have a group of minstrels called Bare Naked Ladies. I knew it. Uh, they're out of Luskin. Mm. Oh, oh, yes. Yeah. Of course. But their reputation precedes them. <laughs> Love it if I had a million gold pieces. <laughs> <laughs> so shall we continue then? Sure. Let's keep going until we find somewhere better to take a little Also, for my cheese. Like lying in bed like Volo Thampkadarm did. <laughs> I don't get that. <laughs> it's a bare naked t- ladies lyric. Right, with is it any- th- whatever put in it. <laughs> Does anyone have any last bare naked ladies? <laughs> in five, four, three, two. That scream. door is closed. And the bitch <laughs> moving on. No! I always get them mixed up with Smash Mouth, so I didn't want to say anything. No, they're a way better band Yo. than Smash Mouth. I know. We're walking. I still do. We're walking. We're so walking. you're walking. You walk. You Astro walk. Has some bops. They all die you walk a hill. few miles okay. further, and just as sort of it's getting to the end of the day, the sun is getting low in the sky, it's starting to get to be get towards dusk. Uh, you crest a hill and see uh, in a little valley below, uh, sort of in a picturesque plot of land with like a little. A little, not a super high or s- severe, just like a little, almost looks like it's there more for aesthetics than to block anything off. There's, within this fence, there's like a little plot of land, and there is a sizable house. A big manor. Does it seem like we should be arriving at this place already? Yeah, the place we're heading? It yeah, it, yeah, it was like a day's walk. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, wow. It was, it was 20 miles. When okay, was the got party? it. Wow. What? Incredible. When was the party? Was there they, she did, they just said she entertains frequently. They didn't uh, say there was specifically a party. Does it look like there's a party? Well, there are a few carriages approaching around the front side of the oh, house. Oh, shit, it's a party. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ollie and Jaden are standing next to each other. Jaden is vibrating. Ollie looks like he wants to die. I do not care for parties. Me neither. I'm just bad at parties. This may come as a surprise, but I haven't been to a lot of parties. <laughs> Why'd you laugh? <laughs> no reason. No reason. Hey, no can be reason. nice for the right people. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But it seems. I've the... always wanted to go to a big party. Oh. Well, now oh. is your chance, and it seems the distraction is on for our mm-hmm. heist. Roz, we should go to the party. Okay. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> um, so okay, wait. Job. Sweet game plan, probably, before we uh, go. Um, Does anyone have press digitation? 
Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we're gonna need it. <laughs> Um, that one can't do disguises, oh. can it? It can clean you off. Oh, though, yeah, yeah, yeah. I am gonna give just a... Bloodied. You I'm just you, gonna... There is, there is some blood on you, yes. Yeah, I swear, right yeah, I'm, I'm not doing so well health-wise. Yeah, that would make sense that I would be looking a little uh. dirty. Um, let me just... And I'm, yeah, I'm especially, uh, Jaden and Roz, who are gonna be, you know, have to be presentable. I'm gonna give us a little, like, dust off, a little clean of the hair, a little adjustment of your wig. <laughs> uh, hmm. And, uh, just a light... Yeah. Breeze and and just you know sort of it feels like one of those little misting fans. Just like, My braids have turned into a pompadour. <laughs> <laughs> I do not like this. Yeah. You look uh, great. You're pulling it off. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> How did I do that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it was very cool though. Uh -huh. right. What is uh, our what is the plan? Yeah. Yes. That is um, a plan. So I don't care about the party. I want to be downstairs looking at the stuff. Um, I want to figure out if there is a way in without going through the party. But if we have to go through the party, we have to. Uh, none of us can mess I don't look exactly dressed for a party. No, I mean... They're probably going to notice they didn't invite us, and they don't know us. Oh, that's not usually a thing. If you have the right amount of, of uh, confidence and panache, and you walk like you uh, know that you belong there, you can get pretty much in anywhere. Like this? Okay. No, 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 like this. <laughs> what about? No. <laughs> to all of that, no. Then uh, like what, Jaden? How, like how would you this. walk? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jane just <laughs> does a little catwalk back and forth. In my imagination, you are like walking a circle around the rest of the park. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. A little My Fair Lady action. Mm. Yeah, like a toss of the wig, a toss of the cape. From what I can tell, Jade has okay. walked into a lot of parties mm -hmm. he wasn't invited to, and yeah. uh, I guess he must be pretty good at it. Um, yeah. So, would it be best if Jaden and Roz go into the party, try to maybe distract the lady of the house and the rest of us can try to find another way in would that be She's I think we should look too. at we should oh. we should look at the entrances first we should sure. see how Circle. let's take a little look at the lay of the land before yeah. we get in, get on in there usually in a heist kind of situation you know i'd like to be in another room with a with a map and you know like looking at blueprints cutting up the the pieces of where we all should be give us all individual jobs this is a heist on a shorter timeline i understand but uh didn't you say you'd never done a heist before but I've been thinking about it for a long time. I see, yeah, it's like you dream. Yeah. Dreams are important. Um, this Bruh. is... Oh, sorry, so what, what are we... How what far is... are we from the house? I mean, at this point, probably like a good 200 feet. And from like the fence, you said? And, and, yeah. Well, you're like up on a hill, mm. the fence is down below you, mm. and then there's the lawn beyond how that. How far if is I... the fence from the house? It's 60 yeah. feet. 60 feet. Mm -hmm. If heist movies have taught me anything, we should not talk out the entire plan. Yes. It will go wrong. <laughs> so here's what we'll do. No! Cut. No, no, no. And then we just, uh. and then we just cut to later. <laughs> wow, that was easy. We, you know, can, we, can we roll to have a montage? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, make a montage check. Uh, Everybody got it? Great. So looking at the house, the layout of it, there's that, the, the, the fence and then like the 60 feet. The house itself is two stories, like largely brick with like wood like framing and like trellises and stuff yeah um and, and the sort of thing that it's like you know there's like wood beams in between the bricks in places in like a tudor housey kind of way does it look halfling sized um well from the outside i know we're at a distance so maybe it it's not it, obvious, but... From the outside... It's actually only, like, 50 feet away. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, wow, oh. Uh, from the outside, it, it doesn't look, like, necessarily on a halfling scale. Okay. It looks like it maybe could be somewhere between, like, human and halfling scale. Okay. But, it, I mean, again, it is a person who likes to have perhaps, probably larger acquaintances over. For sure. Okay. Wants them to be comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and then there... the. You're sort of getting a view because you're kind of up. Uh, you can see a little bit around to the front, but you're sort of approaching from like the side, like maybe like three quarters angle. Uh, and there, there are a couple of carriages on their way up outside. There does seem to be around to the front of the side of the house uh, a stable that like people are getting out of the carriages and they're being shown over, brought over to so that the, stable. Like, There's like a large stable. The stable. Can we see doors from where we are? Like. Front doors, but can we also see like any other? You actually like... probably don't have a line of sight on the front door itself from okay. here. Okay. 
Uh, but give me a perception check. Yeah. And obviously, it's like, I want to start circling around the house, taking a look at every entrance. Ooh, nat 20, baby. So. Perception, you said? Mm hmm. 10. He gonna see them doors. Nat 20. Uh, you don't see a lot of doors on the side. There are like at least two entrances on that stable. You do see one like door on the back side yeah. of the house. Relaying that information across my scout size. It's the first thing you learn. <laughs> the doors are made of stone. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh boy. Oh boy. So there is a back door. Mm. And presumably a front door that Jaden could go through. Mm-hmm. And Ross. And Ross, yes, of course. It looks like people. Are... I get to come too. <laughs> yes, you yes, do. You do. Uh, it looks like people are being led over from the stables. So I think we should probably, when we obviously we're not, we don't have a carriage or horses or anything, but we should probably go there and then mingle in with the people going yes, in. Yes, yes. What was the deal with her treasure? She had some sort of a vault. Was she it? has a vault mm-hmm. in her basement. Remember, you mm-hmm. promised only take what we promised to take. Yes. We'll be there. I'll you be... promised me. And can you two We're best friends. please try and hold her to that? promise to your All best right. friend, Roz. Hey, you're making a Ron. real lack of eye contact. Don't think I'm not noticing. Ron, this was the deal. You yeah. get your heist. You get your heist. We all We get a that. squeaky clean conscience. Okay. Except for all the murders we've done. <laughs> <laughs> Self-defense. Look. It's not like we... <laughs> all right. It's debatable. We don't talk about those. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Uh, <laughs> the deaths well, we've you know, all caught. We have to be ready, you know, if we're in there and there's something hey guys, that's really uh, useful. Does my microphone look lower than it was before? Yeah, it's yeah. a frame. <laughs> huh. Interesting. Weird. Uh, Good call. You. It's been slowly, <laughs> slowly coming. Ascending. Your microphone says, loving. hey, what you doing over here? <laughs> I'm to give you a little forehead kiss. <laughs> yeah. 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 You're doing a good job, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Great. Uh, that was a microphone, not me. Although I, I, I do, I do have the same sentiments. Me. Kiss included. You Thank fine. you. Hell yeah. All right. Yeah. Let's so, uh, let's do this heist. Uh, okay. Can we, before we break, give me ten minutes? Yeah. Great. And I'm gonna keep like discussing elements of the plan. So like, so we've gotta go in through the back door, and then we're gonna try and look for a vault, I guess. Um, what would I know usually about like rich people's houses and like. I don't know. Bron, you know, where a, here's where a, question a vault door would you. be. Um, and know, like, actually, same question. <laughs> yeah, we've both been in rich people's yeah. houses before. For different reasons. And here's a question <laughs> for you, Bron. Would you like to know how this heist it would go a little bit before we do it? Yeah. Oh. I pull out the scroll of augury. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> now we're doing Mr. it. Mr. Godlybags. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs a plan when you got magic? Uh, so I'll read this out loud just so all the players knows what's going on. Oh, God. Uh, yeah, c- let's just pretend one of us has no idea what this means. <laughs> <laughs> I've never yeah, actually I've cast augury, so I don't yeah. know. Either. Oh, it's such a fun spell. Never used this spell before. Uh, by casting gem inlaid sticks, rolling dragon bones, laying out ornate cards, or employing some other divining tool. Like a scroll? <laughs> like a scroll. You do not need the, the, the tools for nice. the scroll, yeah. Uh, you receive an omen from an otherworldly entity about the results of a specific course of action that you plan to take within the next 30 minutes. The DM chooses from the following possible omens. Wheel for good results. Woe for bad results. Wheel and woe for both good and bad results. <laughs> Nothing for results that are not especially good or bad. Ooh. The spell doesn't take into account any possible circumstances that might change the outcome, such as the casting of additional spells or the loss or gain of a companion. Oh, if so you cast the spell two or more times, but we're not going to do that, so we don't got to worry about that. do remember, the more specific it is, the easier it is to answer that. Question, so if yeah. you ask wheel or woe for this heist... Generally. Yeah. <laughs> Could be real vague. But if we this got the wheel or woe for finding and the lantern or like finding the vault. Or like an action to find the lantern, maybe. Yeah, yeah. you'd want to be asking maybe. about essentially if a specific action is a good idea or a bad idea. Maybe should we go through the back door to find the lantern? Mm-hmm. That'd be a or, good question. Do they have better charcuterie in the party than we had on the road? Of course, Ross gonna have a really fun time at this party. <laughs> Ooh, actually, that's <laughs> a pretty good have one. An amazing time. <laughs> What what uh, what question should we ask? You pick of those we just said. How about that? Uh, <laughs> I think the back door, if that's going to give us a good chance of finding the vault. the vault. I ask that. And again, the it, the two it, it's not a yes or no question. It's a 
good fortune or bad fortune question. Fair enough. So the question is just, if you're asking about going through the back door? If we go through the back door, will we be more successful than going through the front? I think. Is that fair? Because that's a yes or no. That's a yes or no. I think, yeah, I I think it, will we have He's good going, fortune if going, I go through the back door? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't need to, to ask for yeah. question. Yeah. You need to phrase it as a plan. As like an action. Going through the Just back door and action, try to get the And it will tell you good or bad. Lantern. Lantern. Yeah, yeah, going through the back door to get the lantern. Wheel. Okay. Oh. okay. That's good. That's good. And does the scroll just that's like burn yeah, that's up? Yeah, the scroll. Yeah, literally, just the, it doesn't burn up, but like <laughs> the text all just disappears <laughs> off it. Mm. If you you say this, it clo- you like cast the spell, it closes for a minute, and then just is it just paper away. now? It's just a sheet of parchment. Can I use it to copy spells? <laughs> yeah, great. <laughs> My paper. Yeah. Reduce, reuse, recycle, baby. <laughs> I am a wizard. I'm broke. I need paper. How much? Is paper expensive? Yes. Oh shit. I'm gonna say it counts as one gold worth. <laughs> but it had a whole spell on it. Before. <laughs> Devalued. But that makes like no. Oh, that's not helpful because that's not a spell level. It's you don't, paper. you don't, Amanda, you're not using, like, 50 sheets of parchment to write down one spell. Some of it's scratch paper, some of that is for the ink. I know, and but. And for, for I, like, ingredients So I'm to going do to go and next time say, like, can I have 49 gold worth of paper? Which is 49 sheets of paper, apparently. <laughs> and also, it, like, the 50 gold is not just paper, it's other things, too. Fine inks. Yeah, I'm, get, I'm also, gonna like, get a fucking the, discount next like, Part time. of the assumption is you're like doing experiments yeah. and tr- making a tent, so there's like reagents and things I included understand. in that cost. It's just then it says like, all right, so next time I get 49. Yeah. And that'll be- Welcome to paper chat. <laughs> <laughs> this is a Welcome sheet of paper, Amanda, I'm wizard. sorry. So Welcome just, to the staples. <laughs> so just so I'm understanding, the three of us are going through the back, paper. the two of them are going through the front. One sheet. <laughs> I'm going to the fancy party. Yes, Ross is going are. to the party. Should I do a vol? <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Absolutely. frigging I have been to parties, but they are mainly just my family birthday parties. So I assume it'll be pretty similar. Yeah. I'm, I don't think there's anything I can do that will make you. Probably not. <laughs> you said I can't help you here. I meant for like the oh. whole thing. Just like trying to be helpful. Roz, when um. you're at a party, uh-huh. a fancy party with rich people, uh huh, and they start talking about things that you're not sure you know about. Uh-huh. I'll ask. L- no. And then I'll learn. Wait, wait. Look disinterested and like these people are boring you. Okay, like this? Not like you okay. don't understand, okay. but like you're a little above them. Okay. And like mm. But I'm below almost everybody. Well, the lady here is a halfling, so you won't be. Me. Hopefully she'll have some halfling friends. Okay. If they think that you that they're boring you, that puts you in the position of power. Okay. Yeah. Okay. How yeah. did you know that? Don't worry about it. Oh, you have snuck into rich people's homes and observed them. What is like our a creep. plan for meeting up after it has been yeah. Deny it. Um, I feel like question. an hour or two hours should be long enough to get anything done. Maybe three. Maybe yeah, we can I mean, if it's a good party, maybe we Ross need, and I could just meet you all after. But we don't want to not know that you're getting hurt up there if they catch you. So it should be an agreed upon meeting time of an hour or two, I think. Hmm. Hmm. If you yes. really like the party, no, that, that you could come out and then go back in again to have some more fun. Two hours, meet back here. Do we want to yes, meet that, that a little further good. away, just in case? Y- yeah. Yes. Is there any? Are there is any there... interesting like landmarks or anything? Even perception that might check. be kind of memorable. I'm meaning even like not in view of this house in any mm. way, shape, or form. Maybe something like that back we passed. Back at that meadow uh, we were in, or yeah, something. Like perce- I got a natural twenty, twenty-one. Nice. I got a natural one. Can we just like meet back at the meadow where we fought the orcs? Exception. It was a little. I mean, that was like three hours away. Okay. And we did 17. take a short rest no, after that. We did. No, oh, we did not. Okay. We cool. decided just checking. So we could take one now, but. Uh, Jaden, looking around, you see a little ways off, like along the hill, the sort of line of the hill that you are on, uh, set a little, not a hugely further back, but a little bit further back in the house, there is like a rocky outcropping with like a sort of tallish boulder on top of it. It almost kind of looks like a thumbs up. 
Amazing. Damn. Mm. All right, so we meet back there uh, two hours after we split. Mm-hmm. All right. Yes. Uh, yeah. I've ever seen on the other side from the man. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Um, we should have a backup plan if we get caught down in the vault basement. We should pretend we were at the party, and we just took a wrong turn. I know you're not good at lying on the spot, either of you two. Mm. So I will do the talking on that. And the hand axe stays in my belt. Yes. yes. We don't want to hurt anyone here. And if anything goes okay. wrong, we don't know that. Yes, I was just going no. to say that. Mm-hmm. Okay. And if Very good. if Agreed we enough. happen to see you on the floor, and uh, you know, if we happen you have to, to get have on to... the floor. <laughs> This is when, very different from halfling birthday party. Um, you know, on the floor of the party, like you know, at the party. Oh. Um, then, if we give the this signal, mm-hmm. it it means get out of here and go to that rock that's shaped like the thumbs up. Mm. That will just Agreed. make out into just the general public, and you have to be watching us because if we turn directly at you and give you a thumbs up, that might be weird. Might mean something else. I mean. Okay, well, it, we'll come to it when we come to it. Anyway, if anyone right. asks, we got lost in the party. Yep. Um, I suppose try and, yeah, look your best. Um, is it, uh, is it, is, 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 go ahead. Is it weird to be at a party with weapons and armor and stuff like that? Yeah. Hmm. Also, we can say we were security. Also, oh. how many people, I know it's hard to tell, but like, can we kind of glean from how many like carriages. carriages are arriving about how many people? Because if it's like a dinner party yeah. and you guys wander in and go, we got lost, that's... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or hey, I mean, even for us, if it's, we're walking into a dinner party like, hey, we our invite got lost in the mail yeah. and there's like no seats See? at the table <laughs> open for us. Someone here's I mean, an I imposter. assume you were going to play more like a... I've heard you were someone originally. Yeah, yes. I, not yes. we yes. got invited. I was going to do that. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So I you just may meant be able like, like. But anyway, back to my, my actual out of character question. Yeah. Can we tell approximately yeah. how many people are. Um, I'm going to say at this point, you've seen about four carriages arrive. That feels how like. How many more are in that big stable? You don't know. Mm, oh, there's actually carriages in the stable? They were leading them oh. into this. It's like an over large stable building, they were leading cool. them inside. Classic. Like sort of a combination, like stable for the horses, garage for the carriages. Should we send one, possibly the swiftest and the sneakiest, to run a little bit of reconnaissance? Let's go and check how many carriages are in there. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm gonna try and- I do not um, wish to waste time. Time I, is up. I nothing, think it's but... probably best if we just go oh. for it. Because it's either good or it's bad. The Scroll of Augury did say bad, no matter what happens, we are good to go. Going through the back door. Fantastic. Is that what it said? That's how I heard it. It said the to back... go through the back door. <laughs> I've got the thumbs up. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, anyway. I've seen that at a party once. Let's, <laughs> yeah. let's, let's go. Okay. Uh, at, that after this whole 10 minutes, I've been ritually casting to tech magic. <laughs> uh, okay. You, the, <clears throat> the, you, the, you feel the spell take effect, the sort of aura out Great. from you. Um, aside from stuff already in your guys' possession, yeah. nothing at the moment. Cool, is that's fine. Giving All right, let's go. This about is what time of ten night minutes? Is it? Mm-hmm. About what time of day is it, or night? It is it, it, like the sun is about to go down. Okay. Oh, damn! Eight hours passed since we've been traveling. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, your temporary hit points are gone. Damn. Oh, I need to take a short rest. <laughs> <laughs> so. Okay. If I had lost some... Fashionably late. Fashionably late. How does late. that affect? Am uh, I still just at the number of hit points I'm at? Like, I, I lose all like, those temporary hit points many, right now, right? Or do I lose how many, five how many more did hit you, points? How many did you have? I had 25 and briefly, lost, and but now I'm back four? in. I lost nine. So do I go down to 11? You, or, go, you go down to 16. I was at 16, because I was... Okay. My regular I hit I would point. generally track temporary hit points separately. It's not temporary, though. Oh, it's no, aid. it was, it was, yeah, yes. aid. It was so aid, yeah. I normally have 20 hit points. I went up to 25 hit points, and I was hit for nine points during that so last take fight. Five so you off this. take Perfect. five off of the max ammo card. That's what I thought. Okay, cool. Uh, do people need a Oh, little... actually, wait, no. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, but... No, because it's not temp HP. 
It's you got healed for it and the max raise, you don't lose the current. Oh, so we should be so I'm at 16. Oh, yeah, sorry. It, it I thought that's what you were saying. HP. That's what I you thought you were saying. You don't lose any current. Okay, so your max changes. If you get healed, yeah. you'll go back to yes. your regular max, but you are uh, at what you're still uh, do people Do people need a little healy heal so we can... Do, I wouldn't mind a little healy heal. Who's, who's, who's hurt? Who's hurt? A little bit, but I'm just going to a party. I yes, assume yes. I won't need... You know, you I think I need a little bit if you have it, but not if you don't have it. I don't, do. I'm gonna. Don't worry about me. I'm going to cast uh, da, 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 Cure Wounds, I believe. Is that Cure Wounds? I'm gonna get. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah, yeah, Cure Wounds. So I'm gonna take uh, both of your hands, and you're going to get uh, 1d8 plus 3 plus Preserve Life. Uh, so this plus 3, so 7. Uh, Ten points healed to you both. Oh, I said you. I don't need any. Are you? I'm good. I'm just going to a party. I'll oh. take it. I'm happy. Thank you. Yeah, I yeah, appreciate it. Whoever wants them, I don't care. You <laughs> should take them. So you should take them. <laughs> um, I am going to uh, use two charges from the staff of defense. Okay. To cast an armor. Cool. All right, okay. So that's um, one slot. One slot. Or, sorry, one charge. It's one charge. It's been once left. <laughs> I love that song. <laughs> and it's great, isn't it? Oh, it's going to be in my head that, that one group of bards? Yeah. One word the the ones we don't speak of? I imagine because yes. <laughs> it's coming from the staff this time, um, like, it's just, so it, it, instead of looking like the smoke that's usually around Ollie, it's, um, let's make it sort of like translucent, like blue light glass. Ooh. Oh, nice. nice. Fancy potty Super outfit. Cool. Oh. Fancy party major. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, cool. Okay, let's go. All right. On. All right. Um, yeah, let's just do this, Ross. Right. Uh, let's, let's head to get, the stables. Let's get this <laughs> feisty heisty on the road. Alrighty. Um, we're gonna the three of us minus Jaden and Ross. Sneaking we're gonna through yeah the back. Sneak, sneak, sneak in the, uh, oh, into Ross, the back of the building. Can yeah. I grab the potion of invisibility? Now, do you want me to sneak? Because I got my chain mail on me. I'm not very sneaky. I do want you to do your absolute best. Do my Should absolute best. Okay. be invisible. That would probably help. Yeah. Holy <laughs> <Like> shit. <laughs> <laughs> Should we wait? Um, maybe you can wait. Maybe hold on to oh, it for God. later, just in case. Because oh. I'm not the least mm -hmm. sneaky person here. Mm -hmm. um, great. So you two go. I have detect magic up for the next ten minutes. You guys just try and do what I do when I'm being sneaky, okay? Uh, and then when which, we which is <laughs> uh -huh, kind of comes naturally. <laughs> Good advice. <laughs> then, uh, because of my new spell slots, guys, I do have the ability to cast silence, which might help us a little bit. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's gonna Let's be my last. Uh, go off. It's gonna be my last second spell slot, but when I think it'll we, be worth it. That's like a. An area, right? Yeah. Okay, it's so a, when you uh, get into the thing, maybe. Yeah, 20 foot radius sphere centered on a point I choose within range can of 120. Can the point he chooses be a moving point? Like he can be the point it's centered on, or does it Sorry, have wait, to be wait, a Sorry, this was which spell? Area? Silence. It can't just uh, be I like. I you choose the point. Yeah, but it can't so be too. like him and he, it moves with him, can it? No, it's okay. it is uh, An stationary area. once you put gotcha. it down. Gotcha. Okay, so we should wait to use it until we get yeah. to exactly. a place where we can't be noisy. Damn. Do. Okay. We won't be able to talk to each other once it's up. Yeah. <laughs> so we really uh, shouldn't do it until we're set. 20 word radius sphere that you place uh, within 120 feet of you. Okay. It lasts yeah. up to 10 minutes. Cool. Wow. I also can't cast spells once we do that, so. Mm. Oh. Okay. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Something to keep in mind. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. So we go to the back door. You yeah, go we go to the, to the front. Door. They, I suppose you guys kind of head to where the carriages are yeah. filtering in. Yeah, I think we head to the stables, and while we're going there, I go. And... So yeah, you know what to do. And honestly, I don't even think we are going to need to lie. We can just say we heard there was a party here, uh, and we wanted to stop by and check it out. We can tell them our real names and, and all that shit. And then I we go to parties all the time. Well, you can be honest. You can say this is your first party, and I can say I've been to so many. Um, but it's your first, and I wanted to treat you to a really special party, which is true. Because okay. I think you're really gonna like this. Okay. Yeah. All right. This will be great. You're going to be great. People are gonna love you. Do I have to be Ross? You do have to be Ross. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you guys make your way to the front. Uh, you come around the side of the house. There is, uh, like a sort of 
circular drive almost with like a little fountain in the middle of it. Classic. An entrance into the house off to the side. Uh, there is uh, a uh, like a butler or valet like speaking to some people who are getting out of a carriage. Now, are you just walking around the side of the house and up to him? So or? you said carriages were going into the stable and it seemed like people were filtering out of the stables? No, they're getting out of oh. the carriages in the drive and heading for the door and the stable is being taken to the to the the stable. Got it. Um I mean I think we just come around the side of the house, honestly. Is there a road that leads to this house? Yes. Okay. That's okay. what the carriages are coming up. Makes sense. All right. Maybe we take a little bit of a I mean not that it matters. They're still going to potentially see us just like fucking walking up. But at least to have some sort of, we're not just like coming out of the bushes at them. Uh, yeah, let's yeah. give ourselves some sort of entrance. And I'm gonna say I'm so, Teresa. I love that for you. <laughs> All right, so you're Teresa. going like around the stable to the road. Yeah, yeah. Gotta give me a good cross. stealth check. <laughs> oh, as you oh, oh, I see. Go oh, yeah, yeah. Well, okay, from the are. house to the stable. Okay. I'm actually okay. You are at disadvantage because you're in armor, though. Oh. That's not you rolled better than me. <laughs> Find out. Oh! I rolled two 19s. Incredible. Uh, you rolled better than me. And also, that's a crit, so. Oh, that, wait, I think that that's for only for attack attacks. Rolls. Oh. Uh, I didn't write down critical, many notes. But your but stealth is. Yeah, so I have a 20. 20. I did away. Nice. What does Jaden have? Uh, Jaden has a 9. It's that Ross damn disappears. Walk. <laughs> <laughs> Teresa. <laughs> Sorry, Teresa. Well, I'm going like, to say the 20 does enough for you <laughs> that no one sees you. You circle around the stable and sort of come up the drive. And as you're approaching, the, the valet, who has just finished talking to those other people who are headed for the door, looks, there's like a pair of people, looks up and just goes, Hello. Um, Hello. Yes, sorry. Uh, who are you? Jaden Felicius Cross Garden of Baldur's Gate Cross Gardens. And will kind of do a flourish and ex like flap his cape back and like kind of expose uh, honestly both swords, Caspian at one hip, Talon at the other, uh, and just strike a pose. He sort of yeah, looks exactly. Down I will like present my calf. A little, like a little book he's holding, mm -hmm. and just sort of looks. Like oh, I won't be in there. Um, ter me and my friend Teresa. Teresa yeah. Bean Soup of the <laughs> Bean Soup. Bean Soup. Is From that a name, or are you some sort of soup merchant? No, 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 no. It's my my name. <laughs> are you here selling something? No. No. We heard about this party, and I, uh, my family, um, well, you see, uh, we're very well known in Baldur's Gate, and we do hmm. a lot of parties, uh, and I happen to be in the area, and I thought I'd stop by and see if this party was, um, well, uh, I thought if, if I could uh, bring good word of this party back to my family, uh, perhaps uh, we could establish some sort of a friendly relationship. And I'm here too. You've come all the way here from Baldur's Gate. We stopped in Neverwinter. I see. Isn't it and then we made a little stop in Phandalin. Mm -hmm. It is in Neverwinter that you heard of the party? It was actually in Phandalin, surprisingly enough. Those, uh, Phandalin? <laughs> yes, I know. Give me a deception check. We did. Uh, we did hear a party in Phandalin. We did hear about this party in Phandalin. Nonetheless, <laughs> 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 in a different way than you were implying. <laughs> okay. I yeah. still think you were deceiving this man. In, in a way, uh, it is a liable mission for sure. Uh, uh, th th um, that's a nine. A nine? I will reach into my bag and pull out my bottle of Amnian wine and go, "We brought wine." <laughs> <laughs> Roll a real quick persuasion on that one. Absolutely. Got it. Ooh. Thank you. Uh, 21. <laughs> uh, it, was goes, all it was all you. I see. Um, it is a very nice bottle of wine. And you were in the area? Yes. Is it a, is it a closed list kind of deal? I can. It is, but I will speak with Miss Oakridge and see if she wishes to bring uh, extra guests of uh, a noble family of Baldur's Gate, you said? Yes, tell her uh, Vernadette in... Cross Garden would be uh, um, greatly pleased and appreciative uh, of it. I will. Um, wait here a moment, if you would be so kind. 
Happily. And he heads into the house. Meanwhile, around the back. God, I'm good at this. God, we're good at this. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you guys ma- are making your way across the, the yard mm-hmm. up to the back door. Mm-hmm. Go ahead and give me a stealth check. And I'm also going to yeah, look baby. around to see if anybody's coming, so I suppose it's, stealth it's all just stealth. Yeah. They can't possibly go wrong. It was mm-hmm. wheel. Stealth. Stealth. Is 24. <laughs> Hopefully enough to outweigh whatever they roll. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. And for perception, you said it's a nine. Uh, sorry, what was the stealth? Twenty-four. Twenty-four. Nine. Six. You guys are. I'm carrying this group on my back. <laughs> not quiet. Uh, I am. You are. They're not. Sorry. They're. Hrothgar is clanking. Ollie is like popping. I'm doing a little my best. Right across the field. <laughs> That bad con. I just think like the, the detect magic guys. He drips. Okay, so okay you're bumping into one. Uh, you can only see me. I can only see However, magic. if there is anybody watching, you don't see them. Mm-hmm. But nobody approaches you. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm gonna check this back door. I'm, I'm assuming there's no magic that pops on the back door, or is there? Within thirty feet, nothing pops on the door. Okay. Several okay. somethings oh. pop behind the door. Okay. Okay. Several points of transmutation magic. Mm, a Several doorknob, that's easy, I'll turn it. Hold on, several <laughs> points of transmutation? I know this one. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got the answer to this um, riddle. <laughs> so there's, on the other side, there's a lot of transmutation magic. Mm. That... I forget which one that is. It, it changes, things change from one to another. Mm. Okay. Shape-shifting. Um, it could, like, sh- changing form, changing... What other things fall under transmutation? Because I know it's more than that. It's it's a lot of changing form. It's shit. a lot of changing form shit. I'm so sorry, everyone. Keep talking. <laughs> We're being sneaky. I got you to be talking. Okay, shh, just, you know, uh, as for the door itself, it is like a fairly thick-looking oak door. Mm. Um, it's locked. Mm. There is a keyhole. Okay. What kind of objects or? Um, Constitute transmutation generally. What do you like, mean? What kind of objects? Like, um, or I guess more. Are there any sort of like transmutation spells or items that aren't necessarily about changing like traps or something? Like, it's certainly possible. Transmutation magic is, is it is the yeah. ma- a magic of changing, changing the something. form. Yes. Of things. Yes. Okay. Cool. Sorry, Amanda is not smart enough to figure out like what this might be. Is what I'm trying to figure out. Um, cool, great. Well, but Ollie might be. But Ollie might be. But <laughs> would I? It's water breathing. Would either like would we be able to to <laughs> strength addition? <laughs> Perfect. This is something we would recall, like knowing yeah. about security measures where you might have some sort of transmutation yeah. spell behind the door. Me, give me just a general intelligence check. Yeah. I mean, does could, it make sense? Could I, I think nope. of that like with Arcana? Yeah. Thank Three. You. <laughs> also, this is just like player thinking out loud, so take for what you know. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> it's possible that you could like rig up a magical effect mm-hmm. that when someone does a certain thing, it sends out a spell like polymorph or something. Okay. Mm-hmm. But you would think that would be on the door. Mm-hmm. Are you yeah. are you articulating all this? All yes, right? yes. Yeah. Perhaps if you wish to disguise a valuable object as something mm-hmm. not valuable, mm-hmm. true. perhaps the lantern will not look like a lantern when we get in. Yeah. I'm yeah. going to start trying to jimmy the door open. I'm going to okay. get my lock yep. pick Give me a- out. Dexterity check with thieves tools. I'm gonna keep yeah. a look at it a little bit. Stand just on guard. Perception check. It did say wheel. It, yeah, it's like it it's probably anything, not trap. Right? It just plus my dex. It's dex and plus, you're proficient plus, in yeah, thieves no, tools. Absolutely. What did you take your expertise in as well? Um, sleight of hand and stealth. Okay, so it is uh, dex and proficiency. My proficiency. Because you are proficient in thieves tools. But two plus two. Everyone's is plus two at this plus point. Plus one, cool, plus cool, one. Cool. So I get that plus <laughs> six. So 13. 13 does not quite get it. Uh, I will allow further attempts at this. Okay. But the DC will go up a little. Yeah. And enough failed attempts do may result in a I bad do have effect. guidance. Yeah, I'm going to cast, uh, as I'm watching, you know, I'm yeah, just going to reach over. Right uh, what was the result on that perception? Perception was uh, 15. Okay. So you start making a second attempt with the guidance as she is starting to do that. You do think you are actually starting to be able to hear 
footsteps coming around the side of the house. <laughs> quickly, quickly. I swear, guys, quickly. I'm usually better at this. <laughs> but not this time. Oh, shit. Um, that's an 11. No, that's a 10. Including the guidance? Oh, what's guidance again? D4. 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 Also, don't be afraid So it's going to be 10 plus somewhere in the full yeah. range. To so dole that guidance out like candy. Because right. <laughs> yeah. it's an at will, you can just be like, boom, 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 boom. Yeah, that's a 13. Oh, 12 then. So, okay. so she's having a rough time. She is having a rough Jimmy, time. I'm gonna, uh, does it sound like one guy, like one person? With that check, you're not sure how many. Okay. Mm-hmm. I'm going to, uh, like, what, is it kind of like a, like a, like a steps down kind of thing? Like, are we, like, right out in the open if they round the corner? You are out in like? the, you are out in the open on the back of the house here. There's, like, a little stoop outside of it, but that's it. The so backside of the house is relatively just, like, Do you straight just line. let us know that someone's coming? Yeah, I'm going to give right. you guys a heads wait, up. Wait. Expertise is plus more than that, right? Yes, it's more but you than don't my... have expertise in the thieves' tools. Right. Wait. I gain expertise with two skills or thieves' tools, and I chose skills. Yes. Got it. Ding. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pass me. Expertise is Damn. you double your proficiency bonus for Got these it. things. Yeah. Okay. Mm, time to do something brash. Sorry. Keep at it. Keep at it. Okay. And I'm gonna start just kind of hustling to meet where okay. the noise is coming. Towards the noises. Yeah. yeah. Times a Did you guide them again? Did you guide her in? Did oh, I what? Yeah. Guide her again? Oh, can I do? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Before I, before I left, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, a little harder on the back because I'm a little. Uh... Oh, and that's a nat twenty. Hey. And you get a little bit more time and feel something set and the door opens a crack. Didn't even need the guidance that time, but with it. Rucker a. is running towards where the footsteps are. Rucker, Rucker. <laughs> <laughs> Turn back and uh, you guys pop in through the door. Immediately. Uh, the who's what? What order are you going? Me in? first. I will be right after. All right. So Rothgar, you were the last one in. And just enough. catch sight of two guys who look sort of a mercenary vibe to them in leather armor coming around the back of the house as you slip in and close the door. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, out front. Oh, sorry. You're doing great. The. Uh, I think he really bought the Teresa thing. <laughs> yeah. Totally. The uh, butler comes back out. <laughs> goes. So Miss Oakridge uh, has. Disagreed to uh, let you enter. Uh, she is most interested to meet people who have come from so far away. Uh, you may enter uh, and make your way uh, into the parlor. Excellent. Roz bows. Jen <laughs> <laughs> uh, kind of elbows her a little. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you. Uh-huh. Um, and this is me, Jamie. I probably should have mentioned this before, but I will mention it from now on. I do have this background feature position of privilege. Mm-hmm. I am welcome in high society, and people assume I have the right to be wherever I am. <laughs> uh, the common folk accommodate Straight me and avoid my displeasure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why do you think I picked it? It's clearly the best Gosh. ability. Uh, the other people of high birth treat me as a member of the same social sphere. I can secure an audience with a local noble if I need to. Mm-hmm. Cool. All right. Um, what was your name? Brentino. Brentino. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Brentino, right. fuck How yes. Hot is it? <laughs> and then I'm we will head Sorry? In. You heard me. <laughs> you walk away. <laughs> I walk in. And you guys go inside. There's like a grand foyer just inside and like stares up. And you do see some people milling about the entrance to a door off to the left. And it seems to be people in there. You make a in. I stash the wine immediately. Yeah, a sizable, <laughs> a sizable parlor. Uh, a number, like a 20 or so, maybe just over, people milling about. There's like a big table of assorted food goods. You nuts and fruits and like little meat treats. A double charcuterie day. Oh my <laughs> gods, we hit the there jackpot. There is weirdly front <sighs> center what looks to be an enormous dish of raisins. You can uh, go for those if you want. I'm, <laughs> and then, I'm gonna go for the meat treats. <laughs> Just like silent. And then you hear a voice from somewhere in the room go, New visitors! <laughs> oh, how exciting! Please, please, I must hear all about you! And you turn, there is a halfling woman approaching you, blonde hair, uh, held back by, like, a straight-up tiara of, like, metal carved in this. It, it's, like, clearly gold, but, like, car- uh, uh, worked into this, like, swirling little headpiece, like, diadem headpiece with, like, little gold chains connecting it across the front. Uh, she is wearing uh, very brightly colored robes. Um, she is a little plump in features, um, carrying 
her own private little dish of raisins. Uh, <laughs> oh, I hate her. She Gross. loves raisins. Uh, and uh, uh, wearing a number of gold rings, like gold, a gold necklace, like a lot of just gold jewelry. Not even a lot of jewels on it, just worked gold. Wow. Uh, except for one piece, a little pendant hanging from her neck that is gold, but set in the middle of it is not what looks like not a gemstone, but just like this very, um, very pretty, purplish, slightly almost iridescent stone. Like, not a gem, just a stone of a pretty color. <laughs> okay. Sweet. Uh, and she approaches you. Meanwhile, in the back, the if three only of you... you were there uh, to use your stone cunning. Damn it, you could cun that stone. <laughs> um, now that we're through the door. You come inside. You are in a kitchen. It's like clearly the, a size of a kitchen for a mansion. There's like, you know, mm -hmm. like a big space, many stoves uh -huh. and stuff. There is food cooking in here. Like, dinner is working. You can smell, like, roasting meat and cooking stew and everything. It's all in process. But you look around and are shocked because there are no people in here. Huh. It's all the food is being worse. cooked by free-floating utensils. There is just a spoon stirring pot on its own. There are tongs just, like moving rolls out of the oven oh, to a Oh, baby, tray. we got a beauty in the beast house. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so is this what's pinging the transmutation magic yes. for me? Yes, it is the utensils. Oh, I've okay. seen this before. Rich people like to do things like this with magic. Mm. It's useful. Yeah. Um, <laughs> magic costs money, you know? I know. Um, yeah. Yeah, you, you know. <laughs> yes, you spent you stole 45 my paper. minutes debating <laughs> over a piece of paper. <laughs> <laughs> Haggling for a discount. Um, what kind of doors wizard. leading out of this kitchen? There is think? one door across the room from the back door you came in through wizard. leading out of the kitchen. Okay, can I go and listen at that door, see if there's anyone behind it? Give me a perception check. Yes, I will. Am I pinging any other magic from the... Um, oh, one or a seven? Because I, I flipped it immediately, and I think it was a one. Nothing at the moment. I, I think there's a seven right okay. on the yeah, side. Yeah, there's a seven right next to it, which is why I'm not sure. I think I rolled an at one on my listen, so... Mm. Great. Cool. Plus one, though, so two. <laughs> You don't hear anything? Yeah. Um, I'm, uh, I'm, at, I'm guarding this back door still. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. You hear those guards go by outside it, but they do not come in. Excellent. Okay. Um, do you want me to... Yeah, maybe let's just like ease this door uh, open. Standing I can't hear about... anything behind it, so I don't I think there's anything I, and I, I'm not pinging any magic. And there's nothing else interesting in this kitchen, really. Just the, the floor. If you want to look around, you can find out. Nothing at a first glance, but if you want to take a mm. quick look I'm around. I'm going to grab a bread roll and have a little munch on it. Okay. Uh, are, are we good to go? Yeah, let's go. Uh, to standing about ten feet back, I may hand the door open. Okay. Assuming it's not locked. Just slightly open, maybe? Slowly opening the door with the mage hand. Oh, my favorite song. You slowly open the door with the mage hand, and it's open. And on the other side, you behold... Nothing. He's gonna say nothing. Yeah, it's an empty hall. <laughs> uh, you can, with the door open, start to hear, like, a little bit of uh, Monica, not in here, but somewhere off in the distance. EDM. Murmur of people. <laughs> <laughs> Does Lou Vega exist in this universe? <laughs> Goes oh. now. I need to switch up the music real quick because oh, we yeah. are fully in. Oh, good call. Fancy party music. Fancy party uh. time. <laughs> <laughs> nah, dudes. I have a caper playlist. Ooh. Oh. 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 Um, oh. Once I'm we're through the hall, is there magic pinging from any? No, Direction. and the hall contains uh, 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 four more doors. One on the left, two on the right, and one oh. at the opposite mm. end of it. Oh. <laughs> how, how, how big, how long is the hall? Uh, it's like maybe 50 feet. Okay. Somewhere like that. Um, shall we go to then the hall? Is Do any of the doors look significantly different from one another? Or? Mm -mm. Oh, man. One at a time, then? Yeah. I suppose everybody listen to a door, see if there's anything behind it. Sure. Okay. Um, I would like to actually first like walk just uh, to, like 20 feet down the hall. The like, keep, magic. Yeah, to, keeping an eye out for traps and stuff. Because the thing we're looking for is magic, so if you're still mm. running that spell of yours. Oh, I'm hoping. Um, can I carefully walk down the hall, making sure to not step on something? Yes. Uh, I'm going to check this hole for traps for my friend, Ollie. You're going to to check for like mm -hmm. pressure plates and things. And Why do I have two handbooks? I don't know. 
Huh. Perception. 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 Per
may I formally introduce uh, myself to you? Please. I am Jaden Fallacious Cross Garden of the Baldur's Gate Cross Garden. Cross Garden. Yes. Indeed. Oh. Well, it's pleasure to meet you. I am Lorna Oakridge of Neverwinter. Um, have you ever? Uh, do, you, do you own any of my work? Oh, you know what? Um, I think. Wait. Uh, what is your work? What is your work? I guess is the question. <laughs> Do you not know who I am? I've heard of you, but I don't know Jewelry, of your work. All of this. <gasps> oh Beautiful. my gosh, it's ravishing! Oh, yes. yes, I have a whole um, a, a few minds that uh, work to mine this and send it to me, and I work this all into with. You know the utmost skill into the, sh the uh, beautiful pieces you see here. It's why most other people. I had told you right there. that they were in the jewel trade. The she's the jeweler. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, you probably did. Uh, you come from so Tip far. Baldur's Gate. You're also. Oh, there goes my pencil. Oh no. Oh no. And they're almost. You're also alive. from Baldur's Gate. Uh huh. Uh, you must. You've traveled so far. You must have interesting stories. I would love. To hear about your travels. Oh, we would love We'd to tell love you of them, to. yes. Yeah. Uh, but first, um, do you have any raisins? I do have raisins. Would you like them? Oh, I would love one, yes. Raisins, oh, thank please. you, my dear. Oh, this is, oh, these look great. Hmm. <laughs> Delicious. I find the dehydration really concentrates the flavor. Yes, yes, yes I would say this please, is. Please, tell me your stories, though. Oh, yes, absolutely. I've heard all of these people's stories. I want to hear yours. Oh, I would love to tell you my story, absolutely. I've had a bit of trouble with um, my jewelry going missing lately, so perhaps, no. since you are in the business, uh, perhaps Maybe we can I'll talk have a business. something something for you at the end of the party. I can oh, slip back to my workshop. There's no need. I wouldn't want to take you away from the party. <laughs> well, okay. Tell me about your travels. Yes, let's find Did a place to sit. anything exciting happen? Absolutely. Shall we find a place to sit? Uh, there's many stories. <laughs> of course. Please, let me show you a little nook over here. Yes, oh yes, okay. let's go, Teresa. And you go with her. Excellent. Meanwhile, back in that laboratory, <laughs> the last thing you see on that uh, workbench uh -huh. is a pile of what looks vaguely like ornate jewelry. Like, the shape of it is like, it's uh -huh. it's been like, worked into like, elaborate swirls and like, patterns and things. But it's all sort of bland, ugly metal. It looks like maybe tin. Oh. oh. <laughs> and this is all chemical. Uh-huh. She, she has the she, alchemist's she's, stone from Harry Potter that turns <laughs> tin into gold. The philosopher's Whatever. Stone? We call it alchemist. We actually don't have No, we don't. Anyway, we call it sorcerers. It's just a anyway, piece of folklore. Um, so... And I, from the things that we're seeing, I can I tell that this is what is it? Give me an Arcana check. Can I also just like this seems like kind of a shifty kind of a okay. not thieves kind of a thing, <laughs> 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 like, kind of enterprise. <laughs> like maybe like she's it. turning things. See into... if it works. It well not. Uh, you said Arcana. Yeah. Thirteen. Not is a great she for me. sixteen here? Turning things into gold, or is she pretending things are gold? Um, I'd say like. It's not common magic, mm -hmm. but, you know, I would say you haven't seen the, the, the finished jewelry. Mm -hmm. So, like, you might not instantly put it together, but, uh -huh. like, this is weird. Yeah. And, like, yeah, turning other metals into gold is not necessarily a super common thing. No. Like, you might have a vague inkling that, like, this is some sort of weird transmutation thing she's yeah. doing. Yeah. Yeah. With she's doing something with this it's, metal. This I I don't know. Uh, Do you think she's legit or no? I mean, transmutation isn't really my specialty, but mm. it, it it changes one thing to another. This is not. This isn't gold. This is this is tin. This is. So I. It yeah, seems I know gold, weird. and this is not gold. <laughs> yeah. I know stone, and this is not stone. Mm. So between us. We've got a good crash. And I know tin, and this actually is stone. tin. So. Uh, another room, then, yes. Mm -hmm. um, are there any papers around just that I can see? Uh, or like, gotta get that paper. Give me an investigation <laughs> check. Or like post transition uh, gold that is now valuable. No gold in here. Uh, that is a modify. Uh, sorry, investigation. Well, there's none, so it doesn't matter. 
you do find like a ledger that's marking transactions and you see now she is absolutely buying like getting loads and loads of very cheap mm. metals and then selling tons of gold and that's probably enough to put it together that she okay yeah, it's not like necessarily strictly illegal it's but just like interesting yeah honestly yeah. all it, these problems it does answer. feel something like a racket yeah yeah I skipped that class in school. I wish I could do that. Jeez. Again, not my specialty. Anyway, not in this room. Um, I guess let's check out the next one. Okay, let's check out the next room. Um, so I guess which it, the closer door on the right or the farther one is closer to us now from uh, the left door. The, uh, you're probably closer to the far door on the right. All right, shall we do that one? Let's do it. One more listen. One more listen Maybe to that door. Check. Uh, 16. Seven. Uh, How wet does it sound? <laughs> don't hear it. Great. Okay. Uh, is the door locked? Oh, and I'm going to go back to the other room and lock. Can I lock the door on yeah, my way out? Yeah, you can lock it yeah. on my way out. Uh, is this new door locked? Yes. Okay, um, let me give that a go. You know what I'm doing. Giving me hands. I'm stepping five. I feel the comforting presence of my friend behind <laughs> Dwarf me. Dwarf explaining. Yeah. Dwarf explaining. <laughs> and plus the guidance that. Let's imagine you just unnatural. come up behind her and like ghost pottery. Her <laughs> <laughs> doing things. Um, like, a, like giving the back. Oh. Um, <laughs> plus a way dex was it? The right swear. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so twenty-two. Twenty-two. Nice. Uh. You very easily manage to just pop the tumblers into place and pull Click. it open, and you see stairs leading down. <gasps> down is good. Like Meanwhile, in the party, mm-hmm. she has shown you over to a nook with a couple of couches in it. Desperately want to cut back, and Roz is just doing one of those. And the farmer says, <laughs> We don't have any goats. <laughs> 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 what what a good story. Uh, pithy. So, did you actually live and work on a farm? I did, oh, yes. Oh, it's been so long since I've talked to the little people. Oh, I know, it's well, too adorable. I, oh, oh, yes. I'm about as little uh, as And someone comes come. over and walks over to the little area you're in and is like, Lorna, I have to. She's like, go away. I'm meeting new people. Uh, <laughs> did she become a little hobby <laughs> scene right there? <laughs> yep. So, oh yes. what about you? You clearly yes. have uh, some sort of pedigree as a... Um, I don't know the term weapon guy. Oh yes, my family, the Cross Gardens. They are weapon merchants and oh. uh, dual competition hosts and hostesses. Competition? What is yes. the competition? Uh, well, um, you know how nobles will engage in swordplay for sport. I'm aware. It is the grandest competition you have ever witnessed. What is it called? It is called the Baldur's Gate Swordplay Games. That sounds. Lovely. Is it, it is. a good one? I've never been to that one. Oh. And I've been to a million dueling tournaments, and frankly, I'm starting to get a little over them, but I've not been to yours. You have not been to the Baldur's Gate Swordplay Games? You have not seen a Swordplay game. I will have to come. I've been wanting to do oh, you must. more traveling. My family will put you up. More traveling? What? I'm wanting to do more travel. Oh, yes! Oh, my I'm goodness! I'm getting... I don't know yes. about you. I don't know how much time you spent in Neverwinter, but at a certain point, you've seen everything is to see in a place like Neverwinter, and I'm getting a little bored of it, I and I'd love to see you. some new places. I can't tell you how, how much I felt that during my time in Neverwinter. Did you take like, the Ugh. tour? What, like a walking tour? Yeah. I'm not a person who takes walking tours. <laughs> I mean, look at okay. that. Okay. <laughs> yes, of course. Raisin? Oh, of course. <laughs> dried. <laughs> mm, dried. <laughs> so anyway, have you yes. seen any interesting monsters in your travels. Oh, recently. Have we? Yes, absolutely. Have you ever seen up close a bugbear? Several, they're dirty and bold. Yes, they are. Meanwhile, downstairs. <laughs> uh, you guys make your way down the stairs. Your detect magic is still up. Yeah. Uh, you don't... <laughs> You I don't, don't know why I do it so quickly, like there's a time <laughs> limit on it. You don't get anything on it until you come around the landing and are going down into the cellar itself. And then uh, something in view uh, pings as soon as you're around the wall and can look at it directly. Hmm. What do I get? Uh, there is a statue of a, half, a slightly plump halfling woman in robes at the bottom of the stairs. Mm-hmm. You get illusion magic just right around the statue's mouth. 
And at that point, the spell ends. It has been 10 minutes. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Kiss it. <laughs> what a big illusion kiss. <laughs> the, the, the mouth of that statue is illusion? What? I don't know. <laughs> Are you trying to trick me into kissing the statue? <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, I, before the spell ended, there it was illusion magic, so something was cloaking, and I'm not sure if it's... Should we take a closer look, I guess? Sure. So you start to make your way down the last flight of steps. Before you get to the bottom, you do get like into the room enough to mm. sort of see a bit of the room you're entering into. Uh, it is a basement. It is, it is like a, it is the basement of the house. Mm -hmm. So it is uh, a little. Um, Can I? There's like oh, plain wait. stone walls and stuff, but there are de there's decoration in here. There are like throw rugs and things all over the floor. You see you see a bear skin or two. There is this obviously golden, gaudy golden statue of the halfling woman. Uh, there are a few like bookcases. There are also you appear to be, the store, stairs are like coming down into the middle of this chamber. You can see at the very least a door to your right, a door to your left, and on the wall directly ahead of you, past the statue, an enormous heavy metal door <gasps> yeah. with like, it seems a, like a one. crank wheel yeah. on it. And there appears to be a combination lock on the front of that. Goo goo gaga! Don't ever say that. <laughs> You're not I even in the room. I didn't hear Jamie. it though. Uh, 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 all right, huh. carefully walking in. Are there? Are there Can I check the traps? So yeah. Give, give, are you, oh. give me a perception check what to you check for traps. Goo goo gaga. Oh. You know the thing I hate. Fifteen. You know Jen's favorite phrase. Thirteen. Uh, Five. You. Uh, no. You. Do not see any traps. Okay. Um, What's on the bookshelves? And Excellent. The bookshelves are. You have to. Uh, you're. St I mean, so far as I know, you're still on the stairs. So you have to go over them too, but you can if you want. Uh, there are also like a bunch of paintings around on the walls of the same halfling woman, uh, and like, like super like, uh, 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 in every like. A rich person's house in a movie you've seen, just like crossed swords hanging on walls. Mm -hmm. Um, do you want to take a look at that statue? Because you're a little I... more magic y. Yeah. I would like to send my mage hand, and this is so weird. Uh -huh. I would like to touch it. <laughs> Are you doing one of one of these? <laughs> Your mage hand just floats out. <laughs> oh no! Just no, like shook it. <laughs> palms all over Seven. the face of the statue. Yeah, nothing happens. Nothing happens. No. Fish hook just is, <laughs> and the mouth. It, it's solid. It's solid. Weird. Solid like a rock. Solid like a mouth. <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna get. I'm tired. <laughs> We're all fucking tired, Eric. All these song Don't references. Don't touch that mouth. <laughs> uh, I will like to go to the statue and. I, I can't. So you walk down the stairs to walk over to the statue. Can I? Uh, and tell the anything. moment uh -huh. your feet, mm -hmm. you set a foot on the floor of the room. Oh, you're no. Nothing the mouth, happens. The mouth of the statue <laughs> opens. Oh. And in a high pitched voice says, Password, please. I shoot a look to Braun and kind of go towards my Warhammer. <laughs> Raisins. Why would you? Oh, you I hear... wouldn't know that. Damn it. Yeah. No, I can't oh, damn. Say that. I can't but say honestly, that. such a good uh, guess. Yeah. Just <laughs> random guess, yeah. Raisins. Um, um, uh, what would we guess? Uh, <laughs> jewelry we know trade. she's a jewel yeah we know she's a jeweler <laughs> um we know her name maybe it's her name her try, password is her one, two, do three, we know her four, birthday try, one, two, three, I was gonna say, try password backwards <laughs> uh, uh password you suddenly hear a rattling sound oh shit and you realize oh. the swords on the walls are shaking in place and then they <laughs> detach from the walls and start flying towards you <laughs> So, oh, yeah, baby. Uh, you didn't say the magic word. Uh, uh, and then it was raisin. <laughs> yeah, please. Bronwyn, Krogar, and Ollie roll yeah. initiative. Yeah, here it is. Yeah. Dang. Some goddamn swords. Dang. Thank you. You're welcome. It wasn't done, but it'll be good. Okay. That was the last little bit. <laughs> Fuck yeah! <laughs> this doesn't feel very real. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> well, we're going to find the vault. Yeah. We may not live yeah. to see it. Yeah. Oh, no. But we know where it is. Mm. Mm. <laughs> okay. See y'all at the bottom. <laughs> You alright? Yeah. But for real, DM, what was it? Oh the no. Was it I'll tell you later. <laughs> can I keep, I can I keep yelling time. things, seeing if I get the password? No. <laughs> that would I be mean, cool. you can try. Um, what did I just. Oh. I was a dummy, and I forgot to get one monster card out that I needed. No. <laughs> I drink the potion of invisibility. No. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> You're on your own. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I've got a monster manual in front of me. Let me do it. Oh, hey, All right. good. Uh, okay. Might help. Yep. So it's not see where you are, you know? That's true. But it will end, I think, the second you cast a spell, right? Yeah, attacker, spell cast. Yeah. So. Bit of a dedicated choice. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, we're just eating fucking raisins. And shit. I know who's having a worse night. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I think it's still us. <laughs> okay. What Swords. order were you walking down the stairs in? You were unlocking the door, so you're probably first. The thing is, I don't know. I might be first because oh, I was well, just you taking the thing out. Of front of them yeah, because go I was going to get stabbed. Oh yeah, yeah. So yeah. just putting the other two side. By, the side where the stairs are wide enough to be side by side. I'll put your okay, switch screens. Uh, and nah. I'm not in this part. <laughs> <laughs> I don't work Sorry. for free if I'm we not are in this on scene. on the tools, logo, sir. Uh, can you... I know! All right. He's I'm calling not, us fools. Here we well, I don't know what you know. We're laughing at our choices. Hey, for a second. Um, so, what, okay, what do we think? It, it could have been raisins. Could have been raisins, but we don't know that. Um, I, I wonder if it was like, something like alchemical. She might have, it could be, she like, might have some, uh, It might have been something totally, like, I'll nonsensical. Yeah. Yeah. I think it could just be Neverwinter. She likes having Never people over from Neverwinter. Never just like, mm. that's a place she's excited uh, about. Could have been ASD123. Mm. You know, maybe could she Could have just been, like, mm. Frederick. Mm. Yeah. Does she have a pet? <laughs> uh, that's what I was thinking, like, Yeah, have you guys seen anything running around up there yet? It doesn't seem like she has like any buddy she is close to. <laughs> like she's turning everyone else away, but who knows? It's just because we're so rad. Is Probably. it money with a money sign at the end? Fuck, I hope so. Get that money. <laughs> Probably hold on to your butt. Well, oh yeah, I guess it wouldn't be at the dollar money? sign at the yeah. end. Because that's not <laughs> Damn, that would be hard as Money's... hell. Money's... Um, Gold digging. What's the name yeah. of our high scan, guys? Is it o Ocean's Four and a Half? <laughs> Ocean's Four and a Half thing? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, pretty damn good. Thing fixed. We're on the map. Uh, the yeah. hell you say? Above twenty. <laughs> hell yeah. Oh yeah. Not oh, above twenty. Yeah. Not I. That's awesome. No. D nope. Did Bron oh, I thought that's what the oh hell yeah was. Oh sorry, no, I was just looking at the cool map. map. Uh, Fifteen to twenty. Sixteen. Bye. Wow. Okay. Ten to fifteen. <laughs> five to ten. <laughs> One to five. Four. Two. Oh. oh buddies. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking No, it's bolts. good that you're at the end, so when the sword comes in, skewers me. No. <laughs> get you back. All right. Oh. Uh, I have the best seat to watch it from. Yep, yes you do. <laughs> so, six swords have detached themselves from the walls uh, and are headed for you. Promised. What do you want to do? I'm going to try and... What, what, there's not one that's, like, closest to me. God. I like, think I mean... maybe one of the ones on the left-hand wall? Yeah. Um, if only. The spell yeah. magic. What I'm gonna... Spell? Uh, I don't know. Can I, like, shoot a, an arrow at a sword? You, yeah. you, you can always try. Yeah, you yeah. can. Okay, I'm gonna try and shoot an arrow at a sword, I guess. Well, go ahead and make an attack roll. Um, yeah, the one up top left that I can see. Top left? Yeah, above that chest. Great, give me an attack roll. No particular reason. <laughs> um, cool. That's a, uh, with my thingy, that's a uh, 22. A uh, 22 hits. Go ahead and roll damage. Okay. Hell yeah. Very nice. Hell. Um, getting this sword all scratched up, I guess. Yeah. Um, Scratch it up. Eight. I want an eight. I want an eight. That's the one. Oh, hell yeah. That one's always prepared. All right. Five plus. I'm going to spend a spell slot for something. Sir? Oh, nine. Nine damage? Nine damage. All right. So, I'm gonna give it and try and you know it give it roll mm -hmm. scratches. Yeah. And, oh yeah, and I gotta use the, the make that right. make that metal yeah. super dull. But you can prepare let me give, more. Let me get some. Right. Uh, well, I'll take it. Yeah, you know. So you hit the blue one. 
got like a video. sapphire in the hilt. Jamie, sure. I can't explain it, but yeah. you got mad poker player energy with those sunglasses. <laughs> I feel it too. You look like a poker player. I don't know what it is. Yeah, I feel I feel it too. Uh, it's all right, so you just let an arrow loose. It just sails straight across the room, hits the sword, and um, they're actually like you. It glides with it, and you see just like a little crack form up the blade, metal of the blade from where the arrow hit it. Weak ass swords. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm done, that's my turn. Oh, I'm gonna get a little further into the room, I suppose. I'm gonna try and like go over to the left of the statue, so even though I'm closer to some of the swords, I'm like, yeah. you know, kind of shielded from some of the other swords. So where, you, where do you want to go to? Um, like, 5, 10, 15, 20. So if I go up to left one, up one. 10, 15, 20, 25, so right there. Wait, I can't see me moving on the map. Oh, yes, I can. Yeah, yeah, to there. All right, do you want to use your bonus action for anything? Yeah, I want to, I don't know if I can hide from, like, half of the swords. You can hide from some of them as long as you've, you've got, a blind, like, a, a hiding place, like something to break your mind and sight on them. Yeah, can I, like, kind of duck behind this statue, yeah, like, give me, a, give me a stealth check. Yeah, I'm going to do a bonus action hide, and that's going to be an 18. Okay. Nice. I'm not going to tell you which, but you may be hidden from some of them. Okay. Well, uh, yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then uh, the swords are up. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> All, All of them? them? All these like, oh no. Yeah. Is this, is this what Jaden's swordplay games are like? <laughs> I've never seen them. Should we try to get the door open? This one's coming up here and swinging at Bronwyn. Uh... That is going to be, uh, that's only a nine to hit. Yay. That doesn't so you me. just like dip back as it swings over your head. Yeah. Um, like I said, dumb sword. <laughs> this one is going to. Come to right there and go for a broth guard. No. What's a guard do? That is a nat one. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Suck it, sword. Yeah. Uh, this one's coming for Bronwyn. Oh, no. And that one is an 11 to hit. Nope. See, there's no threat if the what? What? everything rolls huh. Hell yeah. I'm just waiting. This one's coming for Ollie. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that is 16 to hit. Shield uh, from the staff of defense, actually. You have mage armor, oh, right? I do. Oh, yeah, but that brings nice. it to fifteen. Uh, so once again, uh, from, the, from the, the, staff the staff so of defense. So it looks um, instead of the smoke and sparkles, that usually mm -hmm. it's a uh, uh, clear. Looks like a <laughs> looks like a window goes up for sure, and the floor <laughs> just blank against it. I just imagine like a nineties <laughs> roll up window. Damn, I love that. Oh no, no, come on! It's like it's automated. It's like one of oh. those little buttons, like. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh, this one's coming for Rothgar. Uh, that is a 19 to hit. Oh, that'll just clear it, yep. And that will be uh, five slashing. Right. As it just floats through your end, just like a shallow cut along your front. And the last one is gonna... You said five? Uh, yes. Fly its way over to you and attack Rothgar as well. That is 16 to hit. That does not hit. Oh that is them. Get so... Uh, Ollie, you're up. Um, 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 um. Cool. Uh, I am only engaged currently with one of them. So, Bron, should we just get to the door? It's gonna take me a minute to get that thing open. All right. Um, I am going to uh, reach out to the sword in front of me and uh, attempt a shocking grasp. Okay. So, it's made of metal. Yep. Advantage. Mm. Great. Because <laughs> 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 so, it's not wearing metal. Yep. It's no, it's made of it. I wanna, right. This works out. I think it's going to mm -hmm. work, right? <laughs> it's going to conduct some electricity. All right. Um, a 21 to hit. 21 to hit. Going to roll damage. Where are... Oh, it's behind me. It's a deep... Eight! That's how I say eight. Eight? 
<laughs> Sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's only one lightning damage, but it can't take reactions. Cool. Nice. So I would like to run. Yes. Uh, Go for it. Um, With me. Yeah. Oh god, Hrothgar mm. has three sorts of I know, I'm, I'm sorry. Right. Jesus Christ! Um, I'm not afraid, they don't even have eyes! Uh, they've hit you already! Um, fine. I'm gonna run sort of around the other side of the statue. Um, clear, staying out of melee of swords. Um, just as far as I can around the other side from Bronn. Okay. So however far my 30 feet of movement will get, which I think is 5, 10, 20. Almost on... I guess sort of like the north uh, east kind of corner square. So you're going sorry, around the right hand side? Yes. So it's 5, 15, 20, 25, 30 gets you to right there. Great. That's where I'll be. Okay. Uh, and that is your turn? That is my turn. Rothgar. All right. I'm going to cast a spell I never have before. Woot. I might need a little help with it because the wording's. Okay. Kind of spinning room for a loop. Uh, spiritual weapon. Hell yeah! So, casting time is one bonus action, so okay. I get an action before that. Or after, you can do this stuff in any order. Gotcha, and then in the text it says, as a bonus action on your turn, you can move mm -hmm. the weapon up to 20 feet and yep. repeat the attack. Is that? Uh, the first turn you get an attack as part of the casting, and then subsequent turns you can move it and attack again. Gotcha, okay then. We're going to... All right, I'm gonna cast a Sacred Flame yes. at nice. the green one. Okay. I always forget what that is. The they just got a bed deck save the on them. Deck save for the sword. Gotcha. Oh, Dexy is the sword. It rolls a 15. Uh, that. Uh, that sword. meets. I'm sorry. Actually, it's so it's a 17. Oh. oh. That, yeah. Uh, yeah. In which case, yeah, all right. It's it just feet. out of the way. All right. And then, uh. It sort of bobs to the side. Yeah. Then, as a bonus action, I will cast Spiritual Weapon. Okay. Uh, it's gonna look. I don't have a token for this. We can figure one out later. No problem. It's gonna look like my Warhammer. Noise. Just translucent. Oh, uh -huh. yeah. For now, color? it's just gonna be the blank symbol. Uh, Where's it going? Uh, right beside me on, per like, in uh, south of me by purple. Okay. Nice. And, goes bonk. and what, are you, what, are you, what are you attacking with it? I'm gonna bonk that purple one in cool. front of you. Cool. Uh, and that is melee spell attack. Cool, cool. So speed plus five. Ooh. 16. 16 is not a hit. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Uh, Good. Yeah, no. the weapon hits it and it just like, cling, parries the magical weapon away. Mm. All right. I believe that is uh, it for me. All right. Uh, Bronwyn, you are up. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try and slash this blue one that's in front of me out okay. of the way with my short sword. So that one definitely you are not hidden from. Hmm? So you're definitely not hidden from that one. So that will be a normal Yeah, I'm not hidden from that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I gotcha. Yeah. Um, but I did already do a little damage to him. Had you put that bow away? Huh? Did you put that bow no, away? No, so I have to drop it, don't I, to... No, yeah, it's a one-handed sword, so you can just, like, pivot yeah. it into the other yeah, hand. Yeah, yeah. But then you won't be able to use the bow until the sword's away again. Yeah. Um, yeah, I've got a... My short... My short... My sword, comma, short. Um, that's a 15 to hit. 15. Again, like, it's mm -hmm. like people parrying in a movie. It's just clang together. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna bonus action disengage nice. okay. and run over to the vault door. All right. Where the little combination by what, by thing what is. By what route are you going? Can I, like... Go kind of between them and then diagonal. I no, I would. I, I will allow you to use a bonus action to try to go through their space, but you're mm. disengaging, so it's you not like have to go around them. Right. Oh, I'd have to go around the back. Man, I can like go under them because they're floating swords. <laughs> Just like. Nyo. They're still they're still moving with enough dexterity that like they can block you. They can block okay. your movement. Okay. Um. So I don't know. I'd be able to make it to the door. Probably not on this turn, but you get up there the next one. Five, ten, twenty. Would it be faster 25, to go around the 30. orange one? The what one? The orange the sword. sword. I'm about to it. The yeah. orange is down by Rothgar. Or the. the, the, the I have fucking sunglasses yeah. on this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Give Teresa a so break. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, no, that's the only way, way you could go without using a bonus action. Yeah. Well, I was trying to think, or I went around the behind the statue. Um. How far could I get, do you think? 
Uh, I would say my, going, my going around the sword or around the statue. Feet. Try around the sword, 30 feet. I'd be like, what, so that five, would be like five, 15. 5, 10, 15, 20. 20 I'm 30. Yeah, I couldn't quite get. You could get, get like here-ish. Mm. Okay, I mean, that's closer. Yeah, I'll take it. Okay, so you pivot around to there. Mm-hmm. Ha, behind you now. Surprise. <laughs> They do you not say respond to the inanimate magical swords. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and that's the end of my turn. Okay, here come the swords. Oh, Dude, they blue are both going for a Bronwyn. win. Uh, that is uh, 10 yep. and 12. No. Nice. Uh, the, those three are going for Brothgar. Right. Nat 1. Oh. 11. And 22. Ooh, that last one hits. That'll be two slashing damage. <laughs> Just nicks you on the shoulder. Two slashing. And <laughs> that other one is chasing <laughs> Oh, yeah. Africa. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Fighting is almost yeah, hilarious. Yeah, it's so dumb. Ollie, that Feels is like... 18 to hit. Like... No, because the, the shield, shield is, is 20. Because oh. it, it hasn't been my turn since I. Yeah, shield yeah. lasts until the start of Ollie's my, next turn. My next turn. Which Ooh. I haven't had yet. Ooh. You went right after the swords in the last round. And that's when she started the shield, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, no, or did you start no. the... No, you went, one, one swung at you, you did the shield, oh. and then you oh, did, oh, ran away from it. And then it was your Dang, turn. I knew it was either really good or really, really bad. bad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, it's Since they're right be before Fuck. me. Uh -huh. um, well, all right, shielding again. Uh, that is, okay. So, yeah, that still wouldn't, no, yeah. Doesn't, still doesn't do damage. Cool. All right. Thanks, Staff of Defense, mm -hmm. that I can do this so many I know. times. Oh, so awesome. All right, yeah. Rothgar. Right. Sorry, Ollie. Oh, is that the gloss stuff? Yes, it is. Nice. Um, <laughs> once again, I don't like this sword next to me. Uh, so, shocking grasp at the sword next to me. Okay. That's cocked. Mm. Um, mod 20. Hits. Go ahead and roll damage. Five. Man, that did not even roll. And it just <laughs> up and down. Uh, and then I would like to run to see if I can figure out anything about the door. That right. I can maybe help Brian. You move away, you get up to the door, you look at it. Uh, there's, you see the combination lock on the front okay. of the like wheel. Uh, but it's like, you know, like a little yeah. dial. There are no numbers on it. There are just an array of odd symbols. Raisins. And, oh, uh -huh. so are they raisins? For a moment, because I have a little... Uh, uh, Rob Carlos fun for us. Ooh! Wow. Freakish. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Oh, oh it's got some very food! Very nice. Holy oh, shit, oh, yeah. yeah. Wow. How does she know our stream <laughs> logo? Uh, <laughs> just assume that isn't really there in the No, world. for sure. It's, it's awesome. Graphic. No, no, I'm kidding. Uh, I'm kidding. It's I, fucking amazing. That's, that's stunning cool. either way. Yes, I oh, have a second amazing. version of this where the dial is in a different direction in case oh, you want to okay. clear a look at that top symbol. Oh, that's, oh, so that's so cool. Though. There's also an animated version of this Whoa. that I couldn't get to function on Roll20. <laughs> uh, I'll work on it for later. But that's so incredible. That's beautiful, Rob. Fuck yeah. 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 Stuff. Um, I'm assuming that is all I can do for my turn. I can't look at these symbols at all. I mean, you're not going to be able to get anything done with them okay, right now. Okay, cool. But that is I'm what they look like. Trying to figure out what the fucking symbols are then. Wow. Okay. This stuff is cool. I will just shout out to Bron. So there aren't numbers. They're kind of symbol things. Maybe they mean something to you. All right. Uh, Rothgar. Uh, I'm going to do spiritual weapon okay. all day. So I get like two two attacks with that? Is that One attack. Oh, okay. As a, is that a That's bonus, a bonus action? action? Okay, cool. So then I'm gonna cast a uh, Sacred Flame at green. Okay. Uh, that will be 14 to save. Ooh, 14. Double check that. Four, uh, 13. So it does not take any damage. All right. And then uh, bonus action, I'll uh, purple. Okay, so attack roll. Plus five. 13. 13 does not hit. All right, I end my turn. Okay. <laughs> uh, Bronwyn. Um, it wouldn't count as an object interaction to like try and open a whole vault door. That'd be like a whole That'd turn. be a bunch, of, that'd be <laughs> yeah. way more. Yeah. Um, but if you disengage, bonus action disengage, you get yeah, to the Yeah, and then just go and get to yeah. the door, but, uh, but you know, this sword's gonna keep trying to get us. Okay, I'm gonna disengage 
and run over to the vault door and take that, a okay. brief look at those symbols and then uh, just put my ear to the door and start trying to turn you, you, and click. You, you use your action to do that? Yes. Okay. I know it's dumb. Yeah, that is... <laughs> Go ahead, give me a... Oh, shit. No, wait, wait. What? Wait. Can I check for traps before I do that? That Should would be your I? action. Yeah. I mean, that if you check for traps now, and then next time, if there aren't traps, you can try to open the door and maybe. While I'll... you defend me, I guess. Sure. Um, I'm gonna check for traps on the vault door. Check. Yeah. Uh, oh, <laughs> wow. That was wild. Uh, 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 uh. That's a uh, unnatural twenty for a check for traps on that vault door. You don't see any traps on that Fuck! door. You don't see I any think... traps on that door, Bronwyn. The trap is in the middle yeah, of attacking you. Yeah. I think the traps are this, but... It was worth a shot, though. Yeah, I you think never that was know, smart. You never know. Yep. Just, I didn't want to be double attacked. No, I get you. For sure. And, and that's, that's your that's turn? That's my turn. Here comes Hordes. <laughs> Death uh, of a cow- thousand yeah. cuts, am I right? All oh, three of these are going for Bronwyn. <laughs> okay. Who's <laughs> the one messing with the door. Well, I haven't messed with it no, yet. No, that's to be true. Clear. Two are going, so they're attacking the same people. Great. Okay. Two for Bronwyn. That is 15. No. Oh, yes, that's me. That's meets. That meets. So, so it goes to the attacker, is... right? Yes, it does. <laughs> that's me, it meets. Five <laughs> slashing. Okay. And the second one is a 17 to hit. Yep, that also hits. For another two slashing. Okay. Uh, the one is going for Ollie. Hi. That is a nat 20. Oh, Ooh. shit. Good. Ow. Is that the depressing version of Goo Goo Gaga? It is. It's the bummer remix. Yeah. I'm sorry, no. 16 slashes. <laughs> okay. And then three for Rothgar. Dirty 20. Hits. Four, six slashing. <laughs> oh my god. I may not be able to defend you for very long. Uh, 14 to hit. I'm gonna have a go at these swords, How many? I think. 14. Uh, does not hit. And the third one is seven. Does not hit. Okay. What idiot Ollie. decided the two fighters should go to the party? <laughs> <laughs> I think all oh, of wait. us. Oh, wait. Literally all of us. <laughs> oh, fuck. That walk okay. was so confident. Who else would you go? <laughs> it's, yeah. No, it's true. And, and, and Jaden was, was so pushing charming. for it. Like, what were you going to do? Jaden literally refused to do anything but the party. I so. know. Uh, yeah. Ollie. Um, I would like. These swords to all give me a constitution saving throw. All for you? Yes. It's it's a thunder wave. I want them to be farther from me. Fuck you. Okay. Get them. Left to right. That is... uh, Five. That fails. Six. Fails. And 15. That one will succeed. So the one on me, I guess, succeeds. But the other two uh, will take seven. So if they fail, it's seven, and they're pushed um, ten, ten, feet? ten feet back. Yeah. Okay, so that's feet. how much damage? Seven thunder. All right. Uh, yellow is looking fairly heavily cracked. Okay. Blue down. Blue is taking damage. Yeah. Uh, blue is looking very rough, but it is still up. But it Ooh. is ten feet away from me. <laughs> And uh, the pink one is looking. Was, wait, was looking fine. Seven. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, is looking relatively okay, but clearly showing the damage. Uh, they all are knocked about ten feet back. Uh, actually, pink goes a full ten feet. The other two go five feet and hit the statue. Okay. Oh, hey, dear. Actually. The statue falls over, uh-huh. and these are not these are over it. As all of this happening, as Ollie makes this shockwave, this extremely loud, almost yeah. deafeningly yeah. loud blast. Oh yeah. Meanwhile, that's fair. upstairs. That's fair. I made it. You all. It is two uh, floors yeah. down though, right? Because you guys went down from the lower level. Yeah. I, I won't ask to retcon this, but for future actions, I've realized that I can actually try and open a lock as a bonus action. Oh, you got fast hands. I do have fast hands. Um, you can, I would argue, mm-hmm. that's like picking a, a regular normal lock. lock and this not is a, a separate thing. A vault door. Okay, okay, sure. 
Uh, uh, this is a boss lock. <laughs> <Maybe>. <laughs> yeah. So everyone. Well, knows. because literally, just like yeah, it just says it, it, it physically takes longer to like try and hear the things on a combination lock. You need yeah. to sit there in quiet and do it. Yeah. Um, I made a choice. Fast hands, um, not fast hands. Upstairs in the party, you all are in the middle of conversation. I abruptly hear a boom in the distance. And everyone looks up, and Lorna goes, "What was that?" I, and that's where we're starting. Oh, no. I made a mistake. Uh -oh. <laughs> I realized that. Desperate times. I mean, right I get after. it. I get why you, you would do that. You should have done that silence thing right shit. before doing that thunder wave. Oh, I, then I would have ruined cast the effect. It. Yeah. I could, well, I couldn't have cast it. Mm. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm dumb. <laughs> what I probably could have done nah, was cast uh, right silence thing. on the staircase so the sound didn't pass through. Mm. Mm. No, it's no, okay. None of us did this. It's fine. No way to get around it. Sorry. It I'm had sorry. to be done. It's all was, me. Was the back door of the kitchen level they entered the ground floor? Yes. Okay, got it. Okay. Oh boy. All Dang. right. So, so it was only one level down. Dang. Oh boy. Okay. And I think you'll find, if you look at the description of Thunderwave. Oh yeah. It's like 300 feet. It can be heard from 300 feet away. I'm yeah, but yeah, I'm, no, it is. It, it literally sure. is. It that was me. That's my fault. I don't know. What's your floor situation? Stone floors. <laughs> This wood is, floors, this hardwood. Is yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's no. clearly something more than normal stuff. Yeah, for sure. Because detect magic didn't detect things through the walls of this basement. Yeah, yeah. Which, like, a foot of stone. It, you couldn't see the thing yeah. on the mat, on the on the statue, until you got yeah. around the corner. Mm. All right. That said. Okay. That said, we're gonna die it's, next it's still week. A, an incredibly loud, loud boom no, yeah, through the structure of uh, the house. Hundred percent. But we won't die till next week. So yeah, that's or, yeah. Okay. So we'll see what happens. All right. So woo wee. Thank yous, Jen. Oh yeah. No wait. Thank yous. You mean the uh, uh, he does the thank yous. I do the thingies. Yes. Either the one. Uh, yeah. Um, the thingies. <laughs> Uh, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Um, there's a thank you all do. We appreciate you uh, witnessing perhaps our last hours of life in character. <laughs> um, right, yeah, but I'm doing what I love, stealing Jada things. Jada and Ross will be fine. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're having a great time at a party. They're like, who are they? Except I've the never raisins. met them. Yeah. Um, uh, if you look right above Jamie, um, that's all of our links for uh, if you haven't yet. Follow us on social media. Um, we post dumb stuff to Instagram. We post dumb stuff to YouTube, i.e. this episode will be up on Friday. Yeah. Every Friday we release all of our episodes, so if you're not caught up, go ahead and look us up on YouTube. Clean your entire house while listening to, what, 20 hours of footage oh and plus? Um, and get all caught up on us, you sweet babies. And then we are um, also on many social medias, but if you go to our Instagram, it has our link tree that links to all of the things you might want to find. And also, our Patreon. Mm -hmm. So if you are as rich as... Lorna Oakridge. Lorna Oakridge. I <laughs> <laughs> know her name. Um, and if you have the ability to turn tin into gold, perhaps you would like to become a patron of the stream. And you can do that by paying it either the $5 or $20 tier on Patreon. Patreon.com slash Legacy of Fools. We release bonus content, including beautiful character art by the lovely Rob Carlos, um, including bonus videos, um, including all kinds of silly little behind-the-scenes stuff. And... Uh, we really appreciate it. It helps us do things like upgrade our equipment and just continue doing this wonderful silly stream. Thank you so much for watching. Timothy? Uh, before we finish, uh, thank yous for the night. Thank you, as always, to Matthew Hernandez and Edgar de Dios for mm. making our tech oh, do. And it was Matt's birthday last week. <gasps> Happy, hey, birthday. Happy birthday! Happy birthday, Matt! Uh, birthday, Matt. Uh, thank you to Dan Solvich for making those lovely battle mats mm. on mm. Incarnate Pro. Mm. Thank you to Rob Carlos for the original art. Yeah! That's... Uh, such a, it, such a uh, beautiful David is, lock. David is. David Martin's Mende is yeah, our, moderator. Is our moderator. Thank you. So thank you to Sarah Pohl tonight for just sack decoration. <laughs> and thank you to David Martin's Mende for forum moderation. Um, and with nothing further to say, I think that is our show for the night. We'll see you next week. Thank you for tuning in. Mm.